Hey guys, we are live. Mm-hmm. Oh, welcome. It's been a while. It's always a long time between the Thursday stream and the Tuesday stream. I mean, of course, it's 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 like how many days is it? Is it like Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday? So it's it's like four days, but like effectively almost five. I think that's how it works. <laughs> yeah, I, I always miss you guys, but I got a lot of stuff done. We recorded t yesterday one island tour video um, and then edited the one that came up p posted today. I recorded another island tour and I have I wrote down like maybe like four different ideas for different videos that I'm doing. Um, I'm up to a lot of stuff. I didn't fully shave today because uh, I, it kind of like re really hurts my skin when I shave too much. So you're going to have to put up with a little bit of stubble. I did shave a little bit. I am not late. Don't stop saying that. Late crossing? No. You guys are just early. <laughs> you guys are just early. Who's in the chat? We got Sierra. We got Emily. We got Loki Lisa. We got Bunny. Liana. Patrick. Moon Pebble. Nicole, Hennaby, Shelbers, Sean, Marissa, Moody, Fool, Destiny, we got Kayla Crossing, <laughs> Gabriel, Virtuel, Mona Mina, Jessica, look at all you guys, Taylor, we got Rosie, it's been a while, oh my goodness, Rosie, holy, I haven't seen you for a while, we got Allison with like the most fancy name I've ever seen in my life, we got Caramel, we got Katie, Dariah with the bong. Start already, please. What do you mean start already, please? Did I not go live? No, I am live. Don't, you can't trick me. You can't trick me with that. Mm -mm. You can't. Oh, I don't know where my ring is. Oh, no. Whatever. I usually wear a ring on my right hand. Anyway. Juju Judy, what is up today? Woo! Today we are going to be going to a crazy difficult island, or should I say islands? So... First island is going to be a maze, but it's amazing in the fact that the main goal of this island is to find out the dream address for the second part of the maze. And then we have to reach the end of that. I don't know if we're going to be able to do both today, but the fact that I have you guys here with me helping me decipher makes me really confident that if I can find all the clues that we can actually figure out the dream address a lot easier than me by myself and this will be turned into a YouTube video hopefully so uh yeah I actually don't have YouTube chat maybe I can do this um yeah guys say hi to YouTube <laughs> so as usual guys if you like the video make sure to give it a like if you disliked it you can dislike it if you really liked it subscribe and comment and let me know why but yeah anyway everyone's saying hello in chat right now and um yeah we will get right into the video so yeah i think it's gonna be interesting how have you guys been huh it's been a while you like the greenery in the background me too i do love it i feel like this is like really delayed like, it's, it's like really delayed. I have to say it's like a while, but yeah. Okay, maybe I could do this. Maybe I could do this. Now I'll just redo the intro. Let me take get rid of this overlay. How about I do this? Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another Animal Crossing video. Today, we are going to be going to a ridiculously difficult island. Now, this island is ridiculously hard because it's two islands, not just one. So the goal of the first island is to solve the maze and then solve out the dream address of the second part of the maze. And then we solve that one. So it's two islands in one sort of maze. It's going to be really difficult, but I have chat here with me to help me solve it. As you can see them being cursed on the screen and everything like that. So yeah, guys, <laughs> without further ado, let's get into the video. Remember, if you like it, like it. If you dislike it, you can dislike it, I, I, I guess. Comment and subscribe. All right, that was cool. So guys, we are going to mark that for the stuff and uh, let's get into it. So I just finished an island tour thing. Wait one second, let me go back, turn on my overlay. So uh, I finished. Oh, I got to change the time. Got to change the time really quick. But yeah, this is something. This is uh, really exciting. I, I don't know how we're going to do. Like, how am I going to do this? Hmm. 
Oh yeah, have you guys seen that island tour? Uh, I haven't posted in a while, so of course it's gonna be a little bit suppressed for a while, but you know, any engagement helps it, you know? Uh, I was gonna do something and I forgot. Yes, this is what. Uh, transform, full window projector, and then put it here. Perfect, okay. And we got Des, who's a little bit late, but that's, that's I am okay. Approaching. Be afraid. Okay, I will be afraid. I'm always afraid, Des. Oh my goodness. Ah, uh, guys, I forgot to eat today. You know what I did instead of eating? Took a nap. Now that is what I call being responsible. Des, I don't know about you, but <laughs> I am responsible. And I'm never late, unlike you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> So beautiful ancient Japanese town. Yeah, it's a it's a really good island by crossing Callisto and um, I don't know uh, I, the, the thing is is I realized somebody else did a tour video of that island before me while I was taking like my break so uh, Yeah, I realized someone already made the video so I didn't have to but I was just I fell in love with it so much that yeah Yeah Also a question huge question is the stream quality better than before? And on top of that, is the stream um, buffering for you more? Like, is it more difficult? I don't know, because I changed the settings on it, like, quite drastically. So, yeah, the stream settings should be a lot higher quality. And YouTube's really good. It's way better than Twitch in this regard. But if I up the quality, it shouldn't increase your buffering. I don't know, we're going to find out later. That's fine. Is if as long as you're not lagging or anything, then it's perfect. And I don't want to hear a word about how I say lag in the chat. I don't want to hear. I don't want to hear it. So if you guys want to actually solve it with me, I would love that. That would be so cool. If you guys want to play along with me, the dream address I'm gonna put on the screen in a second. And you guys, once I type it in, you guys will be able to do it too. Let me just pull it up actually. What is the dream address? Okay, got it. Let me just put this here. And actually, for today's stream, I'm going to hide... Um, oh, how do I do that? Okay. I think I want to get hide the new monitor setup goal and all the pop-ups and stuff. Because I think that's uh, going to get in the way. You know what I mean? If I'm going to post this, I don't want like pop-ups like of my Twitter every five seconds and stuff like that. So I think I can get rid of that for a little bit. What do you think? Puppy crossing? Oh, I like puppies. You love the quality? Good, good, good. Leg. Why? I don't get what's wrong with me saying leg. Leg. You guys say leg? Leg. 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 I don't know what you guys say. You guys just say weird stuff. All right. And let's hide my Twitter pop-up. Good. Save. Perfect. Okay. So everything should be good now. So the rule is actually pretty simple. Let me actually go upstairs because the music is a little bit bad. Image rules. Okay. So these are the rules. If I can figure it out. Okay. Right here. Do not wear a wetsuit when entering the dream address. It is a two island maid. Recom <laughs> Wait, <laughs> no, no. It's a... Two island maze. Recommended number of players is two of or more, I guess. So, the recommended number of players is two or more. And I guess playing with me or, like, me guys playing with you guys is the second person. The challenge of the first maze is to solve the dream address of the second maze. Do not forget to read the bulletin board. There's probably a lot of, like, tips there. And feel free to message him to share your thoughts, reviews, comments, all that stuff, and enjoy it. The dream address is right there, so if you guys want to like play along while we're, we're solving this whole thing, that would be so cool. So get your switches right now, and uh, yeah, let's play. That It sounds so cool. Um, they also have a cool map for this, which is, is what it is. We're going to pull it up once we go there. So I'm going to type in the dream address, and then I'm going to pin it to the top of the chat i also have a live split thing here so i could actually uh just do this i can uh show you i have a timer right here and it's counting how long it's gonna take me to solve it so we can keep 
track of everything and i think it's gonna be awesome i really really think it's gonna be super cool super super cool um yeah um you need to bring your switch to work yeah that's probably what a lot of people had to deal with actually okay but i'm gonna actually have to control reset okay perfect want to dream <sighs> okay revisit because i've actually been here just to scope out for thumbnail picks but i didn't really get very far what's up aaron I'm sorry oh I missed goodness. last stream, but I'm popping in to say hello. Oh, that's okay. I'm listening today while at work. Two hearts. Oh, don't get don't get fired at work. Come on. I always get worried when you guys are at, like, <laughs> if you're at work watching, you won't get in trouble. Um. Okay, this one is called is. Dis Disan. Is Disan. Is something backwards? Nasid. Hmm. Isn't that the word like island? Like an anagram of it? Oh, you guys work from home. Okay, that's perfect. So the name of the island's a little bit different than what I was expecting. So there's actually a really high chance that it's a clue in there somewhere. Also, Aaron, thank you so much for everything except for the boop. I don't like boops, bonks, anything like that. Okay. How do you like the webcam streams? Uh, I like them sometimes. Sometimes I don't. Sometimes I get like self-conscious about how I look. And uh, I don't like concentrating on how I look too much. I like just like chilling and playing the game. Right? But uh, I think it's fine. Okay, we are here. On the island. The first thing we're going to do is check the map. Because that's important. There is a map actually in the bottom corner where I am, but you guys can't see that. So I have the map right here. Um, so we want to look at some clues. Number one, the first clue that I'm noticing here could be that uh, the names of the characters. So they're Tagasundo, and maybe that means something in a different language, but there's also Quickie. So I feel like one of these names could be a hint as well as the name of the island is Desan. So island. No, it's not island. It could be. Maybe that's an L. Maybe it's L-S-D-I-S-A-N. Is that just a lowercase L? So if we get rid of all of the letters except for island, it would be I. Okay, so like, like this is this is what I'm thinking. So Hmm, let me open up a new text document uh, text whatever I'll call it that let's actually open that up and I want to actually we could we could work on this let's see so if I do window capture okay so if we actually take it so right now we have uh, so let's say L S D I S A N. So if we take the ones from Island, it would be we would delete I S L A N D, and then we're left with the letter S. So uh Island name, we got S. S is also the second letter. Second letter. It's also the second letter in the name. That's something else that I did notice. Let me change the zoom in, zoom in, zoom in, keep zooming in. All right, cool. So that is something I did notice. We're going to come back to that in a little bit. But yeah, that's what I noticed so far. Islands. Yeah, you're right. You're right. But I feel like th that's just a clue. You know what I mean? I, it's kind of interesting. Why is there a chunk of island in the top left corner? Yo, you're right. What? Wait, there's an island in the top left corner. 
Is this modded? Nintendo, you saw nothing. Nintendo, you saw nothing. Shh, don't tell them. Okay, let's read the bulletin board and see if there's anything weird here. Okay. Note that the devil is in the details. For clues, seek Tagasundo. Welcome to is this blah, blah. is this an island? Is this an oh the name could also just be is this an is this an island? Wait, it could just be is this an it could be just a joke of like is this an Oh wait 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 your goal is to solve the dream address for the next island. Maybe we're just overthinking it, okay? Maybe maybe I was overthinking it, but it says the devil's in the details, so that's important. Okay, uh, this looks like a giant maze. Oh yeah, let's just start. Let's just start running through the maze. Crunchy Island. Who? Can I go through? Okay, so a huge thing. If you're also attempting this at home, you can open up your inventory. And you can actually see what's in front, like, uh, if there's anything on the floor there. So we're gonna travel through- wait, is it that easy? Oh, we got through! Okay, so we got through here. I didn't start the timer! Wait, 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 wait. One sec. <laughs> One sec. Start. Okay, there we go. We're just gonna pretend that didn't happen. I already scuffed. The run is already scuffed. We have all these- light things here which actually do block okay can i pick them up no okay um i guess we just continue this way and there looks like there's a maze over to the right let's just keep going red black red black red black is there any patterns is there anything interesting hmm i don't know what we're looking out for we're trying to figure out that so anyway the island is is this then but I'm just trying to figure out, wow, this is taking a while. Okay. I also realized that dream addresses can't have letters. Wait, I just realized dream addresses can't have letters. So why am I reading into the, like that anagram thing? They don't have letters. We're just looking for numbers. I don't know, but we do know that it's the second letter, right? Okay. It's a lot of black flowers. One red flower. Among black, another red. What? What? Okay. This is, these are in rows of six. So there's like, so guys, remember the, the goal of this island is not actually to get to the end. The goal of this island is to figure out the dream address for the second one. So we have two red flowers here. There is something else I do notice. So, this row of flowers is five wide. Okay. And this row of flowers is six wide. You have to remember that. So again, we're going to write in my handy dandy notebook, uh, black flowers, rows of six, red flower equal fourth flower in the, hmm, how far, wait, how many are in between this? So is there one, two? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's nine flowers between these as well. So, uh, flower, six flower in the, this is difficult. Okay. So there's nine black flowers between the two red ones. Red flower is the fourth flower in the, here's the problem is like, how am I going to know what order to put them in? Equals MC squared. Thank you, guys. I think that's the answer. Um, so what is this one? So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then also one, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think that's the important part. I think that there's nine in between each. Okay, so there's nine between each. That's huge. Okay, this is a dead end, but the flowers are important. Definitely. Okay. Wow. Um, there's also... I'm, there's no point counting. Maybe there is. So what, is, what about this? One, two, three, so six, and nine. Nine, eighteen, twenty-seven, thirty-six, uh, wait, forty-five, fifty-four. Right? So... 54 black flowers, 54 plus 3, right? 54 plus 3. No, so it's actually 57. Flowers. 54 first red flower. And then... Uh, again, there's 9 more plus 2. So there's, again... 54 plus 2. No, that's not true. So it's 50. Oh my goodness. There's two more. So. Yes, that's true. This was 54 and then plus 4. So it's 58. Uh, before second one. All right. That, that might be just like nothing. But yeah, that's that's that could be something. I don't know. I'm also going to make this smaller so it's easier to manage. We're going to keep that little notepad uh, just in the corner here for when we need it. I'm going to keep it small and then hide it. Okay, perfect. And it looks like battleship coordinates. Mm-hmm. Okay, so that's what I think. It, that, that could be important. And then it leads to balloons. Okay, we're just going to get out of here. You don't understand it? Okay, yeah. I don't think I understand it either. This seems like it's going to be ridiculously difficult. Uh, I think it's going to be ridiculously difficult, but... Uh... Okay. Hmm. 31 rolls total. Oh, that's huge. 31 rolls total on flower beds that's huge okay how many glow sticks were there does anyone count i guess it's the same number as of rolls plus some i don't know how many glow sticks so this is what i think is going to happen my prediction is we're going to go inside the house and inside the house there's going to be something like an order so from left to right, there's going to be something like a glow stick, a red flower, um, I don't know, something like that. And, like, and then it's going to show them in a certain order left to right. And then whatever number of each of those is, that is exactly the numbers that we need. Does that make sense? So that's my hypothesis. I haven't been inside, but I have no idea how we're going to take all this information and make a dream address. So I think what we're looking for here is counting a lot of stuff and i'm gonna need you guys to count so <laughs> uh how many glow sticks are there so there's one two three four and okay so let's open that back up so we have four plus four plus the 31 rolls which means that's how many are in there and on the other side can, if we rewind the stream just really quick to the beginning of the roll so i don't have to do that again there was one extra than the number of rolls so one at end so that is uh well there we go 36 light sticks okay 15 beds 15 beds okay perfect Whew. okay i don't think we have to count the lanterns but I want to make it to that maze on the right side next. I'm just going to start moving towards it. I guess the entrance would be here. Can I go through? No. Nope. Dead end. 
This is kind of disorienting. Let's hide our handy dandy notebook. There we go. The number of sticks don't matter because it's always constant. Fossils shouldn't matter. Oh! Oh, we're all the way over on this side already. I mean, it doesn't mean that we're going to be able to go anywhere, but... We have to be able to go through here. If we can diagonal step this, then it's GG. Nope, I can't diagonal step it. Um. Oh, I diagonal stepped that. <laughs> that doesn't matter, does it? No, it doesn't matter. Hmm. Okay. Look at the lanterns. Maybe they light the way. That's a good idea if they were different lanterns, but they seem all the same. So what I think... I genuinely just think this is just a, a like a clever maze. That's what I think it is. Okay, uh, we should count the balloons as well. There's a bunch. Oh, there's a tool on the ground. Okay. Oh. I can't go through there. That would have been too easy, right? Okay, I can squeeze through here though. Keep going. Then I can go down. Continue going. And we're here at the dino- the dinosaurs okay oh goodness oh look at this okay uh <laughs> wow let's screenshot this i will screenshot that yes and i'm gonna actually uh, just send it to myself on discord or whatever or just save it here um yeah i'm gonna save that for later that's uh interesting Okay, red balloons. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 red. Oh, let's do a section called balloons. Uh, wait, 11 red. 11 red. Um, there's a lot of tools, but I just want to count the balloons. We got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 yellow. I'll go come back for the tools. Wait, what are the tools? Colorful watering, watering can. So that's one. Two. Interesting. It's like we're deciphering this. Okay. There's a lot of pink ones though. Wait, there's more. Oh no, we have to add them. It's okay. Loons, and then I'll just do this right equals, and then I'll do another one called left equals. So then we can kind of like add them together. Um, how many green balloons are there? So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten green. Ten green. Okay. I saw there's a watering can there, but I'll get it later. It's a problem for future chase. Uh, these balloons are actually going to be a bit of an issue to count the pink ones. Oh, goodness. Oh, wow. This is hard. Okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Um, ten pink. Cool. But there's going to be definitely more pinks and everything like that, so I want to pay attention to it. 15 dinos. Perfect. I got a screenshot of that just in case there is a dino. Um, and then how many blue? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Wait, really? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, 10 blue. This seems very deliberate. Deliberate. All right, we have even more red, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven red. On the left side. How many yellow? One, two, three, four, five. Five yellow. How many green? Four green. Four green. And then we have a bunch of pink. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine more pink. Nine pink. 
And then last but not least, the blue. One, two, three, four, five, six blue. Six blue. Now, uh, now I also have to do totals. Um, we're going to do 11. So we have 18 R. Uh, 14 Y. 14 G. Uh, 19 pink. 19 pink. And for blue, we have 16 B. All right. The watering cans are going to be in our hand. I think I can enter this part of the maze right there. Ooh, okay. So I'm going to go back. Got to grab... Let's grab this last watering can. Oh, we're also at the dock front entrance, which is yellow. I don't think that's important, but <laughs> you don't know with this island. Um, let me get back to the beginning somehow. So there was a watering can that I missed earlier, so I need to go back and get that. Because it might be the color of the watering can. I don't know. Wait, there was one, right? I missed a watering can. Like, 100%, right? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Okay. Okay. Red. Green. They're all different color. Oh my goodness, they're all different color. Oh, that's so bad. Okay. I'm not going to note that down because they're in my inventory, but they're all a different color. What? Oh, maybe they're spelling like the shape of them is showing a number. Possibly. Also, keep your eye out for Braille. <gasps> the pink is making the, le the number seven. The pink balloons make the number seven. Hmm. And the blue looks like a six. Where does the blue look like a six? Genuinely, I don't see a blue looking like a six anywhere. Like, I can see vaguely every number if I look really hard, but, uh... Alright, let me go really quick look at these balloons. I don't see any other numbers. Does anybody else? No, I don't see any other numbers. Um... Is this supposed to be a two? No, there's no numbers here. But maybe it's just on the other side, right? Where we were before. I, I seriously don't think... I would call that a two. Would you call it a two or would you call it a... a like a stretch I think that's a bit of a stretch like in the same way that those yellow balloons kind of look like a four but the only obvious number here the only one that's 120% a number is the pink balloons so that's that's my opinion on it and then pink seven All right. No, no, no. Uh, and okay. <laughs> okay. Also, what's up, Kato? Oh, you said you would not call it a two. I understand. All right. Now we're here. <laughs> we have a watering can, and that's about it. Flashback to Crunchy Island races.
I'm going to check my inventory sometimes to, just to make sure everything's a okay. Any number written here would be visible on the map though, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would be. You need a vaulting pole here. Okay, so once I have a vaulting pole, I can come back here. Right now, all I have is a bunch of watering cans. Oh, I'm sorry. I should have called you Kato, shouldn't I? My bad. What we're going to have a hard time doing is deciphering between design, just to make it look nice, and actual clues. So that's a, a, sev a pink seven, if I ever saw it. Everything else, I would say, is definitely not a clue. The airport could be that, but here's my idea. Is that, we're again, I still think that we're gonna find something in a house or like a shrine somewhere that tells us what order to decipher these clues the green does kind of look like an arrow but yeah nothing here looks like a number um and these dinosaurs no that's a stretch i still want to get over to the side here there's like a little maze over to the right so let's see if we can squeeze by anywhere and make it make it over there nope so honestly, how I'm navigating this, and you guys can follow along at home, is I'm looking at the lights, and I can kind of tell where they're placed and if I can walk through them, and letting them kind of guide me. The lights light the way, so to speak. Okay. So let's go into the top left corner now. We've already been here. There's nothing... I have to keep my eye out for tools here. Oh, guys, if you notice, like, a tool anywhere, let me know. I'm actually going to check really quick. Yeah, I don't think there is any, but that would be so crafty if there was, like, a tool. Oh, can I? There's, there's a lantern missing somewhere here. Isn't there? There's no chance that I can't get to the... There we go. I think I'm onto something. Here we go. Yeah, this is it. No, <laughs> no, it's not. Uh, this is it. No, it's not. Why can't I step through there? I feel like I should be able to. No, I can't. They're too close together. Can I step through here? No. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Abort mission. Um, I will find the way one day. So somewhere in this maze area that I'm in right now, when I was going upwards, there's definitely a way for me to get lower down. <gasps> yes, come on. I don't want to be up right here. I want to get down lower there. I see the way. Okay. I mean, I can't get to it easily, but... How... Like I have to go some backwards route, right? What I need to find is the entrance and then I can solve the rest. Like, I feel like this should be something. It's not, but... Wait, but that's in an awkward spot. Can't... Mm -mm. Oh! Did I just diagonal step like six times? Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I'm onto something. Here we go. We did it. Or did what? We did it. Okay. We're so close now. Can we get to the maze part? Yes. Yes. Come on. Yes. Yes. Let's go. Okay. We are in the library maze section. Now, what's going to be here? Oh, that was fun. Okay. We can cross between these ones at will. 
It's a fun little bush maze, which means we're going to get a shovel at some point. Hmm. The cool thing about this maze is that it's not really just a maze. So if I do mess up somehow, I'm fine. <laughs> I can't go further. So what I would need is a ladder for this section. Right? Do I need a ladder? Okay. Is there anything in here? No. Oh, no. There's nothing here. Wait. Oh, yes. There's this part of the maze. The right part. No. There's not. Because <laughs> it's still a dead end. No. Okay. Let's think about this, guys. Let's think about this. Um. Hmm. Okay. At least we know how to get back here if need be. There's something hidden here. No. Nope. Nothing there. Okay. Hmm. And there's nothing here in the maze. I'm going to keep checking. I, I don't care. I'm going to check every single place that I think they could possibly sneakily hide something. Okay, guys. I'm actually completely out of ideas now. I think this calls for looking at the map. So you guys, uh, so we were on the, we were just in here. Uh, we actually entered through the top right there. We also have been all down here. So we have gone everywhere in this circle. Here's my problem. We can't progress any further. Because, like, this area was the roses at the top left here. And you can see it's perfectly surrounded. We exited through the bottom one. You went through the tree maze? Okay, nice, Iza. Let me know if you find anything. How do I get out of here without a uh, wet... Like, without a wetsuit or... Tool. Okay. Because, look, um, we've been everywhere here, and there was only watering cans. What's up, ninja? Two months. Look at your big gong. How, how is that? How are you doing? You look cute as always. Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, okay, that's actually kind of crazy. The water jumping spot. A tool could have been hiding in one of those jumping spots. I checked almost all of them, but that's an option. Oh, nice to see you too, Alex. Oh, you have to head out. No problem. I get that. I want to check. No, there's a very high chance there is a tool just laying on the ground somewhere. Like in this tree maze. There's there there's a good chance. A quite good chance, if I do say so myself. Hmm. How do we get out of here? Alright, let's keep checking. Watering cans. These are only watering cans, right? Yep. There could be something like way higher up here. Gather tree branches? I don't think tree branches are used to craft anything. Or am I completely wrong? But yeah, I think I'm wrong, but... The tree branches automatically spawn, so I don't want to concentrate on things that are like fossils buried in the ground or something. Because I feel like that's just uh, oversight by the, the developer or creator. Right? Like, there's tree branches, but those naturally spawn all the time. Okay, that had a lot of entrances into it, which makes me believe that it's not actually anything su- Wait, what's that? Oh, that was- Okay. I saw an item on the ground, and I got excited, but that's actually just a leaf bug. Not the leaf bug. I got leaf bugged. Hmm. 
Does anybody... With the amount of watering available each with each can, don't want to test that quite yet. Branches can make a vaulting pole, pole or a ladder? No, both of those are softwood and hardwood. So, seriously, it, and uh, I also want to point out there's no crafting in dreams. I want to point out there's no crafting in dreams. So, I'm not actually on the island. This is a dream address, so there is no crafting. So, everything that I get will be found. What's up, Ninja? I just wanted to show you my slightly bigger gong. <laughs> You're just showing it off? It's not about the size of the gong, I'm telling you guys. It's not about the size, it's about how you use it. Is there another entrance? There is a, probably another entrance into the maze. Okay, that's there's a high chance there's another entrance into the maze here. There is. There, watch, there's gonna be like a better entrance. No, there's not. Okay. But I think it was a good idea for to try. But I, you know, I want to keep looking because there's there could be an opening in the fences that I just didn't see before. Oh, it kind of looks like there's one here. Nope. No. Okay. Interesting. Oh, okay. Um, what if I did this? Does that help me at all? That's so creepy seeing the bug right there. Yo, I feel like I'm going to be jump scared at any moment. Like, high key, feel like I'm going to be jump scared. Ah! Did I scare you? Boo. Hmm. Okay. Let's go back to here. Flowers, I know there isn't anything because I did pay pretty close attention to it. But there could be a little opening here. Hmm. Like, what, what, what's stopping it from being here? Like, right here, along the, the ground, there could be something. Hidden along the wall. You see Slenderman? Oh man, man, don't don't say that. This island's kind of creepy in its own right. It's a beetle. Oh man. Hmm. Very difficult. Cause there's no tools anywhere else. I have checked pretty thoroughly. Inside the airport, there shouldn't. I think this island might be modded. Maybe there is something inside the airport and resident services. However, this is a dream. Is there... Can you even... Like, is that even possible? I don't think so. <sighs> hmm. I'm pretty sure I checked all these little nooks and crannies here, so I don't think that's the case. Hey, what's up, Banana BB? <laughs> that's a name. How are you doing? I'm doing good. I'm doing really good. A little tired today because I'm fixing my sleep schedule, actually. My sleep schedule is absolute chaos, but I almost have it under control. The tools are up there, I know, but I can't get to them. Um, I need to get up there somehow, and I just don't know how. Let's go inside the airport, because I think this island is modded. I have a feeling. There could be anything in here. 
<clears throat> nope. Absolutely nothing. But that's fine. That's what we expected. Hmm. Dang, I know, right? Manifest them to fall off the cliff. Honestly, I wish. All right, let's hide this. We kind of lost. We are kind of lost. Okay, there's a candy here. Which can be used to dig something up. I can use it to dig something up. Like a tree. We found a candy and we can use it to dig up something. Okay. How did I not see that before? Of course I can dig up bushes no matter what. But to dig up a tree. Remember the devil is in the details. That is what they said. There's also tree branches. You're right guys. I should probably pick up every tree branch I see. Because you know what I just realized? The tree branches aren't random. There's only a certain amount of tree branches that can be on the ground at any given time. Uh, spawn naturally. The rest have to be... And once it's above that number, they can't spawn anymore. And I have a feeling there's more. So you just have to put up with me uh, opening my inventory every five seconds. But that's fine. You can shake trees to get branches though. Yeah, but there's certain amount there's a certain amount that are like on the ground naturally, right? How do we get out of here? Okay, that's how. Okay, there's another one here. We're gonna start I think there's gonna be a high number of sticks, because that's more than what I was expecting. Droid, what's up? On my way to the bigger gong. Oh, I saw what you did there. Bonk bonkers. Look, we don't need that this stream. We need all the brain cells that I can muster and yeah, I can't be dealing with you guys giving me less brain cells. See what I mean? Look how many there are. There's nine already. That's way too many sticks. That's way too many sticks. I don't know why I didn't pick them up in the first place, but that's fine. Let's go back to the flower area, because that's the only area that I haven't been to in a while. And keep an eye out for, like, tools or something? I don't think... You out here drinking wine? That is not... This is not wine. I promise it's not wine. It is an energy drink. Every day there's 15 spawning. Well, there might be more than 15. There's nothing behind resonant services? No. There's not. That was like the first place I checked. I was like, oh, that's where I would hide it. But no, there's nothing. Tools might be a distraction. Who knows? Really? Like, seriously, who knows? Now. Nothing I can make out of flower petals. Is there anywhere to sneak in here? Any breaks in the fence? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Yeah, and there's no hidden tools or anything. So the number of flowers is important. Hmm. Okay. Let's keep thinking. Hmm. Something behind the last column on the left. Yeah. But I can't get there. It's painful to watch. 
It, it is, but we haven't been doing it very long. It's, it's only been like 40 minutes, not even. So, I'm good. If I wasn't so tired today, it would be super, super hype, but it's fine. I'm fine. <laughs> what do you mean? Something's wrong. No, nothing's wrong. I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. Mm. Oh wait, no, the wh how you go in is through here. Nope, through here. Yes, there we go. There's diagonal step up here. There's another one. Perfect. Goodness me. There's another one here. Okay. Let's check this out. Wow, okay. There has to be like an opening. So one side requires a ladder, which is this one. The other side requires a vaulting pole. And the other side is a dead end. Right? Yeah, two dead ends. Hey, Kilamina. How are you doing? Oh, man. Hmm. You can't go inside to resident services. Well, number you can't craft in dreams. So that's the biggest problem. But again, I think this island might be modded. So, oh yeah, we can't go in. Okay. Is it going to be something super painfully obvious that I'm just like, Chase, how did you miss it? Like, will it be? You know how much pain I'd be in? Just checking to see if there's any items. I see like a stick there. Oh, there's a lamppost here. Oh, I can't get through either of those. Okay. Okay. Did you check behind the right side bookcase? I, yeah, I checked behind everything. That I could walk to. I would be surprised if there was... So I picked up another stick. Another stick here. Well, 
we're almost at 15 sticks so if it's over the number 15 then it can't spawn anymore which means it's intentional wow this is difficult <laughs> um This just leads directly to the dinosaurs again. That isn't where I want to go. I mean, why not? Why not go to the dinosaurs again, huh? Why not? I found something last time I was there. There's no secret land part to jump on there. I think there is, and I think I'm just missing it. Let me go check one more time. I genuinely feel like I just didn't give it enough time to this jumping part because I was too lazy to jump back. Let's try it again. Let's try that again. Oh, wait, we gotta go up. Okay. Okay. Let's keep going. There might be like a secret jumping area here. And I'm going to triple check that there's no tools in each of these areas. Like it could, there could be one here. Right? But there's not. I also noticed the rock right there. So it could be to do that, like, um, pick up the rock. Yeah, see, there's nothing. I didn't check behind, and we have a wetsuit. There was a wetsuit there. Ah. Uh <laughs> All because I was too lazy. All because I was too lazy. Oh my goodness. Please. Chase Crossing. Chase Crossing. Oh. Also, guys, chat froze for me, so I didn't know anybody was talking for like the last while. I seriously didn't see anyone's messages. So yeah, we have the wetsuit now. I, that could have been prevented. I wasted like 20 minutes counting the number of sticks on the ground. <laughs> and there was just a wetsuit here. Okay, we're cutting that out. For the YouTube video, that's getting cut out. Nobody's gonna know. They, how would they- I have a timer. It was a great idea at the beginning to put a timer here, but I kind of regret it now. Because now everybody knows. And then we jump off the dock at resident services. Oh, sorry, at um, the airport. So all we have to do now is jump off the dock at the airport and we're good to go. Left or right, guys? Let me look at the map to decide where to go. So it's looking like the best place to go is the left side? Wait, where is there any entrance? Yes, right here. So we have to go to all the way to the back of the island to the secret beach. I don't think it matters because that seems like it's the only place with an opening getting me back in the island. This side, the far right, oh, also would get me in there. All right, so we're going to jump off the right side. There's nothing on the left that would allow me to get back in. So we're going to jump off the right side. Yeah, we're going to jump off the right side. Oh my goodness, it feels so good. Okay. Top left mystery island. We can go there later. We can go there later. This is... Woo! This feels good. Okay, we solved that. This is the second... Okay, one sec. I need to write that down in my handy-nandy notebook. There were... Uh, coconut... 
I don't know, coconut drinks. Two. There's that's the second coconut drink I've seen. Right? Has anyone seen more? I don't know. We're gonna, every time we see one, we're gonna increase that counter. Cause that's important. Three. There we go. Now we got three of those. See what I mean? Perfect. There's four. <laughs> four. All right. Well, there's four of them. Okay. Let's keep this going. What's up, shells? Yeah, you, you missed quite a bit, but that's okay. Rewind buttons, a thing. And for anybody coming in late, there's going to be a YouTube video of this. It's going to be a YouTube video of this. It's going to be cool. Super fun. Not frustrating at all. Not not even in the least. Okay. Another dig spot. That's uh five. That's five of them. Let me just check everywhere. Yep, that's five. Okay. So now we're into this part of the maze. I'm just going to commit to this part of the maze. Oh. Okay, can I not get in? There has to be a diagonal jump here. No, it looks like there's going to be a vaulting pole kind of jump. Yeah, that seems like a semi-impossible vaulting pole jump, which I could probably attempt from, like, here. Okay, let's go around to the back of the island, the secret beach, and maybe the really glitched part? I don't know. We're going to see. So there's a secret beach on this island, and there is a secret, secret beach over in the top left corner. Because maybe the island's modded or something. I don't, I don't know. But we're gonna, we're gonna find out. We do not, it doesn't look like we need a ladder. What's up, Alicia bot? Alright, we are here... At the secret beach. But, guys, we already know this is, like, the best sort of things. I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to call you butt guys. I That's not what I want to be known for calling my chat. You guys are not butt guys, okay? You're not. Okay. Uh, you, however, friends, uh, I'm really curious. Let's go and check out the top left corner super secret island, which uh, I, I got to see it. We gotta see it. I also want to swim around the island anyway, because there could be more coconut water thingies placed around. <gasps> Can I get up here? No, there's no way. That's okay. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming, just keep swimming, swimming, swimming. Alright, there has to be something here. Because we saw on the map, there was like a glitched... Yes! This island's modded! What?! Excuse me?! Sir! <laughs> what?! What is this?! Excuse me?! I heard you like island, so I put another island on your island. Can I jump over? Is this intentional? Can I go past the net? Doesn't seem like- oh, I can! Game? What? Okay, good. I'm not stuck. Whew. Okay, I think that wasn't intentional. That wasn't intentional. Um <clears throat> Excuse me? Okay, that's something. Definitely something.
Okay. Let's go back. There was- I was hoping there was gonna be like a coconut water there, but nope, there was not. Okay. Time for a maze. Okay, let's keep an eye out uh, for the items here. Okay, there's nothing. Okay, this is the correct way. Oh, never mind. It's just kind of a circle. Just when in doubt, just run all the way to the left. And I'm going to be spamming the pick up item button just in case there is another uh, thing I can find. Oh, a dead end. But it wouldn't be a dead end if I had a ladder. Which is fine. Okay. No items anywhere? Okay. So that's a dead end. Okay, I go back to the beginning. And then head to the right as far as I can go. Alright, let's head to the right. Great, great start. They're, they're all dead ends so far. Um, am I missing something? Yes, I am. I'm missing something right here. Yep, there we go. Okay. Sar. I'm just going to keep running to the right. Why not? Okay, we're here now where I thought it was like the dead end. This leads to the ramp, which is what we're looking for. Now we're on to the fun old jump puzzle. Oh boy. We are making progress, actually. I feel like the goal is right underneath where I am right now. Let me see if I can get a better angle of it for you guys. Um, I want to make it over here because I think if I can make it that far, I can actually... I think I can actually just jump across over to the heart kind of circle thing. You know what I mean? So let's try that. Yeah, that is that's exactly it. That is it. If we just keep jumping diagonally, we will be unstoppable. Wow, that, that music's actually kind of creepy. Okay, I think we jump down at this point. Then to the left. Diagonal. Right. Heads up to anyone doing this. It is super easy to get lost during these sections. Like, nearly... It, it's almost a guarantee that you'll get lost and might not be able to make your way out. Uh, so keep that in mind, by the way. Okay. Huh. And this is one of those times where it kind of gets me lost. Okay, let's just keep going over here to the left. Um, oh, we can jump diagonally. No, we can't. Boop. 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 Wait, I think I can make this diagonal jump here. Yes, I can. Mm-hmm. That led nowhere. <laughs> and that led absolutely nowhere. Okay, that, that's great. I'm just jumping down every once in a while to make sure that I'm not, like, missing anything. Okay, so at this point, I think I can make this diagonal jump. Which can give me this diagonal jump. Which can get me lost further. No diagonal jump there, so I think we just head here. Diagonal jump. Diagonal. This is one of the most fun islands. I miss doing this. I miss crunchy island races and things like this. Just taking it at your own pace and just enjoying a map. Yes, okay. Alright, I think this is this is it. Yep, we found the end, I believe. Alright, so now I just want to explore this area. Perfect. Okay, so I kind of see where we have to go at this point. 
think I can make the jump here. No, I can't make it yet. So I need either a shovel or a ladder to get further ahead here. Yeah. Okay. So I guess the goal is what I thought it was at the beginning of this. So there was a uh, probably. So this is at least I know how to get here now. Although that's not quite useful. I do want to head further to the right. Oh, I can't make that diagonal. Okay. I think we have to get back all the way to the beginning now. That's fun. I just want to make sure that, yeah, there, I have to make it all the way back to the beginning. All right, fun. Oh, wait, I never posted the dream address for you guys to follow along. Oops. Chasse. Don't do that. Don't do that. Perfect. Now it works better. All right, that's way better. Okay. <clears throat> Don't I have to do this diagonal jump? Yeah, that's how I did it. Let's make it all the way back here. Maybe I go back here? Looks like I'm going to look at the map. Yeah, there's nowhere for me to really get out of here except for the top right corner going to that heart maze. Yep, that's it. Because if I go here, see the heart maze right at the bottom? You see that little like indent with the green square? That's where I need to go. So if I go there, I'll be able to enter the second level of the maze. And that would be amazing. So I need to somehow get to the... Um, no. I think I just jumped diagonally from here. How the heck do I get there? I seriously don't know where to go. Do I go up to, like, the top left corner here? Or do I kind of, like, go to the, um... Don't want to talk about it. <clears throat> oh! <laughs> no mosquitoes, please. I don't need this negativity right now. <gasps> can I do this diagonal jump? I can. And then this? And then this? Oh! I'm right at the beginning again. Chase, you're so good at the game. Woo! Oh, wait, no, I'm not. No, I have to be able to make this. Oh, come on. There's no... I can't make it. Hi, Chase. Hey. How are you doing today? I'm good. How we are you? We believe in you and know that you'll make it through the maze. Thank Any you. Any plans for the holidays? Also, hmm. sending love to Dakota. Heart. Aw. Well, Afterglow, thank you so much for the tip, by the way. Um, so... Uh, any plans for the holidays? Nothing yet. Probably want to spend time with my family. And I want to make the most epic snow fort of all time and maybe film it for a video on another channel. Uh, how do I make this jump, by the way? I have to be able to. I can't. Maybe left side beaches? Like, I don't think that's a wrong idea. That wasn't it? I, I could have sworn that was the correct place to go. Like, goodness, that's so... That's almost embarrassing.
Hmm. So you think... Maybe later there's a shovel. <clears throat> I mean, there's going to be a ladder shovel vaulting pole. Guaranteed. I guess right now we go to the left side beaches. Because I don't see a single other option at this point. But like... Oh, we're so close yet so far away. There's a passage? You might be correct. Oh, wrong button. You think there's a passage on the right side? Be I'm, I'm swimming, so it won't work. It's okay. I'll go there later. I'm looking at the map right now. You guys can't see it because I'm covering it. I think you might be onto something, but I think it's all the pathways are second level. But we're, again, I'm going to find out. I'm very open to finding out. Oh, that's another coconut drink. <clears throat> Six. Coconut water. All right, Sierra, no spoiling where things are, though. If you guys want to play along, absolutely, but please don't spoil what, what things I find. Another coconut drink. Seven. Seven coconut drinks now. That one was really hidden. That one was incredibly hidden. That's eight. Coconut waters. Another candy. Let's go. Eight. And there's going to be another coconut water here. But I already know that one existed. Yeah, I already knew that one was there. Okay. Um. Maybe go to this beach where the... I don't know. Maybe this is the option. How many coconuts? Uh, we don't know. There's a dig spot there. Seaweed, there's three. Or is there four? I don't know. Or that's kelp, rather, right? Although, Sierra, if I am really stuck and have run past the shovel like six times, then yeah, you can tell me a hint. But, uh... Otherwise, I kind of want to figure it out. Like, if it's somewhere I haven't been, then yeah, don't tell me at all. But like, again, if I've run past it like six times or something, then just be like, tell me. That would be great. Or how about this? If I've if you find it and I've run past it a bunch of times, just like uh, tell me I've run past it a bunch of times. That would be more helpful than anything. Let's go back to the far right. You rankest it a few times. Oh. Okay. So that means it's just hidden. Okay, perfect. Okay, that means it's just, like, here. <clears throat> Spamming the pickup button, of course. Just walking around, spamming the pickup item button. That is my, what my life has come to. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, I see the mosquito this time. I see it. I'm not going to get stung by that. No more mosquitoes. Hmm. Am I excited about Friday Pokemon? Yes, I'm actually going to a Nintendo event for that. There's like a little release thing. I'm gonna... Found it! Oh my goodness, the golden shovel! It's always where you, you wouldn't expect it! It's not even hidden. It's at a very important, obvious spot, but that's not a place I would check. No, no, no. They're very crafty. They're hiding these important items beside other important things. So beside this whole, like, j the first parkour area, there was the wetsuit. Beside the ramp here, there is the golden shovel. Oh my gosh. Okay. Now let's go dig up those bushes on the other side that we found. Got a diagonal jump here. No, there's nothing I can do there. One hour and 11 minutes. This is flying by, though. I'm having so much fun. Okay. I think we can do one more diagonal jump here. Let's go. Okay. Please have more digs. Did nothing happen? <laughs> what are you guys talking about? I didn't do anything. Now, there's a chance I don't need to dig this one up, but it's a golden shovel and it shouldn't break. Shouldn't break. I repeat, it should not break. Don't break, please. Oh, God. Dig this up. Okay, are there bushes anywhere else on the island that I just don't know about? Hmm. I'm not entirely sure. You saw nothing? Good. Thank you. Ooh. The library maze, you're correct. I needed a shovel there too. Good point. Yep, the bookshelf maze, you're correct. We'll go back to the bookshelf maze soon. I definitely wanna just not walk all the way back there right now. I feel like that's a bit excessive. If this shovel breaks, I'm ending stream. I'm just saying, if this shovel breaks, stream is over. I give up. I'll do it again another day. I just don't want to restart the whole maze just to do that, you know? Because I would need to go get the candies and stuff again. Okay. The way the villagers are just looking up at you in their captivity, it's like a zoo. It's that easy. It's just like a zoo. I can also dig up a tree. I want to make that known and I can also break a rock. I can break a rock and dig up a tree. Okay, there's no point digging that up. And that's empty. This has to be something. Yep, it is. Isn't that something? See ya, Julia. Okay, so this is a new area. Let's uh, start exploring uh, soon. <clears throat> Oh, 
Oh, there's so many options, but like, I can't. I feel like I have to dig up all of these, like, spots. I feel like that's important, but who knows? You know what? Let's look at the map really quick. Because instead of doing this crazy, like, whole maze, I can actually just look at the maze from an aerial view and just get there. So I can jump diagonally from here. I don't- I think this is a dead end. Yeah, with- without a ladder, this is a dead end. But we're gonna find out, won't we? And... yeah... This, oh, it's not a dead end. It kind of is, but we'll see. Oh, there's a bunch of mushrooms. How many mushrooms? One, two, three, four, five, six mushrooms. Six mushrooms. Okay. Didn't... You saw nothing. Get the tools. True. There were two tools up there, weren't there? Uh, do I, do I abandon where I'm at right now in favor of that? I don't think I can get those tools. No, not from this direction. So I'm going to keep going where I was. It'll probably bring me back there eventually. Maybe, maybe not though. Um, <laughs> where do we go? I'm going to put away this because that's going to get really annoying really quick. Seven mushrooms? You see eight mushrooms. Are we all counting wrong? You're right, there's one extra there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh my goodness, there is eight. Oh, did I just not count? Okay. Thank you. That You guys are correct. This is why I have you guys around. This is why, this is why I keep you guys alive. Around. I meant around. <laughs> alive. What do you mean alive? You guys are all alive and healthy. Right? You're all alive and healthy. This is definitely a vaulting pool kind of situation. Don't have one. Oh, I thought there was going to be like an item there. Hmm. You are all alive, but guys, stop it. It was it was just a slip of the tongue, okay? I didn't mean it. I didn't I didn't mean to say but you guys were butt guys. You're you're not butt guys, okay? Oh come on, I can't make that. Guess not, okay. Again, we would need a vaulting pole, but you guys already mentioned we did see two tools there. And there's also another library maze over on the right side. That's important too. Most likely. It doesn't seem like there's anywhere to go here without a vaulting pole. Ah, uh, maybe, maybe. I think I see something. I think I can actually jump down directly underneath here. Yes, I can. And then jump behind this. No. Uh, uh, I need a vaulting pole. Again, with the vaulting pole. What is this? Like, oh, come on. Yes, there have been digging spots, but none where I'm at right now. You know, I don't want to go to the digging spots. I don't want to retroactively go way back. Although now that I think about it, maybe that's the play. Go all the way back. Wait, I just realized, can I return to the beginning of the island? I don't think I can without a ladder. The reason being is that you can't get back onto the docks. You can't get back to the airport docks. And that's where I jumped off of. So without a ladder, I can't go back through there. So I think I'm on the right path. I think I just keep pushing forward and then we'll go further. Rescue services. True. Rescue services is an option. Hmm. 
You know, that's a really good point. I don't see anywhere to go from here without a ladder. Let's keep froggering it up. Can I make this jump? Yes. Like we're just back at square one right here. There might be something behind the museum. Yes, rescue services is available in dream addresses. No, there's nothing there. No, there's nothing. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> loud. Heard you loud and clear, game. Hmm. Okay. I need to be right back for one second. But what we're going to do is our good old favorite thing. Daily dose of internet. Let's do this real quick. And I will have to be right back. Let me pause the timer. Pause the timer real quick, and uh, you guys have fun. Uh, right, wait, did I just click this? No, I don't want that. No, I want to add to queue, and then I click this. Hello, everyone. This is your daily dose of internet. Uh, your... Why does the seal... Okay, be right back, be right back. Enjoy chair crossing, by the way. It'll sound like a full-grown man trying to speak for the very first time. Yeah. 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 Ah. Allow me. Earth, like planet? <laughs> Excuse me, miss. Do you by any chance work at a library? I try. That's so crazy, because just like a book, I'm checking you out. <laughs> This is exactly why cowboys need to wear gloves. This museum has a screener to see if you'd be able to vote in the United States back in 1870. Are you white? No. Are you man? No. This guy secretly took a picture of a cashier, put him on a t-shirt, and pretended that he was someone famous. Oh my gosh, no way! Wow, okay. It's you? <laughs> that would be me. That's f***ing hilarious. Where'd you get that? How You're the Monday guy. guy. I'm the Monday guy. Do you have a marker? I, I do. Please sign it. The squirrel ate some fermented fruit and was a little tipsy as a result. Gamer, look how close I am. Oh my god. Oh, oh my, oh my god. You've had enough, sir. You've had enough. <laughs> This fan predicted that the ball would come straight to him. I want to catch this one. There I say. Yes, there I say. Oh. 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 <laughs> These people threw some money into a wishing well. What'd you wish for? <laughs> what do you think like I wished for? Please do not attempt, as this is a professional. That is the end of this video, or we hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys again very, very soon. Later. Hello everyone, this is your daily dose of internet. Hey, excuse me, excuse me, is that okay to pet? Thank you. <laughs> oh.
<laughs> you okay? I'm so sorry. <laughs> this guy wanted to bury a bag of flaming Hot Cheetos so that future civilizations will discover it thousands of years from now. It was elevated and All right. seismically isolated. How did you guys so enjoy chair crossing? I am it back. It would get damaged. Already. Then I took a laser and tried to burn off all the germs from inside. I want to finish watching this though. Then lowered the top plate on and hermetically sealed it. And then we buried it underground with Flaming the help of the tractor. Cheetos? What? This cat was absolutely flabbergasted. <laughs> Look at his little face! This guy ran the entire New York City marathon while balancing a pineapple on his head. Good for him. I like him. That's insane. There's a company that is throwing objects into space. By spinning really fast, they can throw objects over really far distances. This is not science fiction. They are still doing tests, but they will be completing full missions to space in about three years. That's such a good idea. Why don't you just throw it into space? Who needs to? Who needs a rocket? Just, just throw it, dude. I've seen this in What's anime. What's your craziest college experience? Oh! Oh no! Wait, what was that laugh? These people use their cat to catch a bug. You people seem to like the last video, so that. here's an extreme close-up of someone sharpening a knife. I'm gonna hate this sound. I hate that sound. That is the worst sound in the world. Don't you hate it when you're trying to cook something and your dog keeps bothering you? <laughs> That's a weird looking noodle dog. Is that a wiener dog? That is the end of this video. I okay, really guys. hope you enjoyed. I want to talk to you really, really quick. Really quick. Uh, so, I started watching My Hero Academia. Yes, I watch it with dubs, though. The dubs are pretty good. The reason is, is because I always do it while eating, and every time I look down to eat, I'm always stressed that I'm going to miss. Like, every time I'm, like, watching with subs... I look down to take a bite and like, wait, what are they saying? 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 I, I don't like doing that. So I watch it with dubs and the dub's pretty good. I don't care. The voice actors are actually pretty good. Now in Naruto, I didn't really like the, the English voice actors, but I really did. I'm really enjoying the voice acting. Just saying. But anyway, yeah, so I started watching that. That's fun. Uh, I just want to get back to this though. So, let's start up the timer again. All right. Oh my goodness, there was a mosquito. Did I get stung by a mosquito while I was gone? Wait, was there? <laughs> it's just watering cans. All right, hold. Could I actually have done this? There's no way. There's no way this is it. Yeah, there's zero chance. Okay. I'm not crazy. But I do want to jump all the way down, if I can, and get those tools down there. I don't think I can, but it's worth it. <gasps> Maybe I can. Wait, no. Please. I fa That's the egg. That's where we have to go. We see it, and I see exactly how to get there. Okay, I just got to get past here. Okay. We can do it. We can get those items. We can get those uh, those tools there. That's huge. Okay, we're like this, we jump down, and we go to the bottom right corner here. It's literally right there. It's that easy. And now we're, if we do this diagonal jump... There we go! Let's go! Let's get those tools! What's up, Jenny? This is maze one. Imagine you get there as a pitfall seed. Stop. Don't even speak like that. Guys, we're doing it! This is insane. <gasps> okay, what are the tools? Tool number one. A golden shovel, a second one. Number two. Oh. <clears throat> okay, we got golden shovels, woo! Let's go! Oh, look at the number of bushes. There's two cam camellia bushes as well. That's huge. That's important. That's suspicious. Okay, so we, we... 
There's nothing to do here now. I want to search around for like one more minute, but I feel like we do need a ladder and or vaulting pool. I can't make this jump. Zero percent chance. Yeah, no way. So, yeah. That was a shame. Okay. Would you rather a pitfall seed? Kinda. Honestly, Steffi, kinda. A little bit. Cause then I, I got so hyped for it. But that does mean we can jump down this way maybe a little bit more. I don't think we can make it any further without a vaulting pole. But that's fine. I think uh, we go as deep as we can in here as for right now. And then what we will end up doing is calling rescue services and rescue services will allow us to go back to the beginning. Is that what we do? Maybe the other tools are buried. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking too. So that's called rescue services. Uh, where is it? Yeah, here we go. Call. Perfect. So let's call rescue services, go back to the beginning, dig up whatever we can, and then go through the library kind of maze thing. So that'll be super exciting. <sighs> okay. Perfect. See ya! Okay. <laughs> you guys saw nothing. I don't know what happened. What happened there? I didn't. I didn't do anything. That's fossil. I need to start dropping items. This is kind of ridiculous. I don't have room. Second fossil. What's up, Alice? All right, let's head into here. Come on. Is there any fossil dig spots here? No. All right, this is where it gets interesting because now let me just make sure there's no fossil spots. We are back into the library part of the maze. And we can actually bypass the bushes now for the first time. That's a lot of bushes. Oh god, no. Okay. I don't know what to do with these. <laughs> I have so many in my inventory. Man, come on. Well, there's another dig spot here, so I can plant them here. There's no place to plant. How about oh, uh, right here? Oh, yeah, it should plant. All right, now let's dig up this. Another fossil. Fun. You could drop the watering cans? True. That's also something I can drop. Um, stop it! <laughs> stop with the mosquitoes, man. Okay. Um, yeah, let's just drop this. Watering cans. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I already, I already noted that, so drop. Drop. No room, I guess. Okay. You can always pick them up later. Right now, we need room. Right now, we need room. Too many directions that I can go. But there's only one direction that we need. Sorry, bad joke. Bad joke, but still. 
it's a good joke if I say it. All right, I think this is the right direction here. If we go down here, oh, is that a dead end? No, I think that's correct. I actually can't see. We're gonna find out. Oh, that was a circle? You know what? I can plant a bush or two here. What do you mean there's no space? Do I have to dig a hole for each one? Wait, there's actually a custom design there? Interesting. Okay. Let's go all the way back. Okay, so... I want to get an aerial view of this because, uh, oh, I can think I see it right here. I think I see that I see the solution. Uh, no, I don't. Yes, I do. That's the solution. It's through here. Not there. Here. Ariel, you got a rainbow gong. Oh my gosh. What's up? Remember, you have a monthly free super chat, by the way. So every month after your first that you remember you should it should say at the bottom like near the super chat button you have like a membership perk and you can get a free super chat make sure to use those members it's really important that you uh take use of that every month you, it's it's what you paid for i know but i'm shy aw okay fair enough all right i just have no room now Put one more here. I'm decorating the island. True. It needs it. Oh boy. Yeah, I think it has to be done. I mean, I know there's a simpler, simpler way to do this, but I'm small brain, so. Wait, no. Chase. What are you doing? You don't need to dig a hole to plant a bush. Tell the bush that, because I keep trying to plant it and it doesn't let me. But that's okay. I don't care. I don't even know where I'm trying to go at this point. Like, where's my goal? Let's check the map again. I, like, sometimes you need to know where you're going. So we're in here. I think the goal is the heart circle thing there or anything around the outside here. So the goal right now is, yeah, to get that ramp over there. I don't know. I actually have zero clue. And I'm used to that feeling, so. My permanent state of existence. Let's go this way. Okay. Can we do diagonal? Nope. Oh, we're actually making progress without having to dig. I like that. I don't like digging. Okay, there's a nook's cranny here. Oh, I think we found it. We found it. And we also found the first rock, which I believe I have a little sneaking suspicion that that's what we need to eat the candy for. We need to eat the candy and break the rock. I can almost guarantee it. So, the rock is blocking the path. We eat one of the two candy we found. Maybe there's more somewhere else, but we've only found two. And now we can break the rock. 
Beautiful. I'm not going to pick that up because you can't craft in Dream Islands. Okay. So can we just like sneak through here? Yes, we can. Is that useful? Probably not. I think that's just for the creator of the island to get around. Yep. All right. Another rock. Okay. We have two of the candies. Woo! We're going pretty far here. Oh my goodness. Let's go. Okay. What? Is there... There was an item here. I was... I knew it. The vaulting pool! The vaulting pool! We have gotten the vaulting pool. Oh my goodness! Let's go! Woo! Okay. I had a huge feeling there was something here because they, they wouldn't just leave us in... That had me scared. Yeah. That, that had me scared. I'm not gonna lie. I was worried for one second that there was nothing there. Okay. So, we're moving on further into the island now. So, where we need to go... We have so many places we can go. We can go past the balloons on the ground. And that's a really good option. But the second option we have is to go back deeper into the maze. I think because we're so close to resident services, we should embrace that. And we should actually go um, through... Why Why don't I just call resident ser uh, rescue services? I don't know. I don't know why I'm walking all the way back. Yeah, call. I'm, I'm walking back there anyway. <sighs> yes, please. All right. Woo! I really thought I got trolled, but the last item we need is a ladder. That's it. <laughs> Woo! As difficult as this island is, it actually has some really good flow to it. Like, it, it just makes sense what happens when, you know, and where things are. It's just really well done. I've kind of memorized where to go by now anyway, so actually really good. All right, we go back down here and we go through the balloon maze all the way to the end of the little jumpy jumps. Wait. A little step animation. I'm not going to lie. The step animation looks so dumb. <laughs> it looks so dumb. I, I don't know. It just doesn't fit in my opinion. <laughs> Like, why am I at, why am I like that, hmm? Oh, wait, now we gotta go up. All right, and now... Ah, uh, here goes the long process, but let's jump all the way to the end here. And then once we're done this... We can use the vaulting pole. This feels so good. This feels so good. Let's go. Let me get the pro camera. I want to make sure there's nothing here. No, nothing there? Okay. Okay. I think there's a vault here. No, maybe not. No, there, there is a vault. No. Oh, is this going to be annoying? Yes, this is going to be so... Oh my goodness, getting back is going to be such a pain. Oh, the chat froze again. One sec, guys. Good. It was like all the way back. You guys didn't even say woo that I found the vaulting pole. So weird. Okay, it's ladder time. Yes. This is like the Alice in Wonderland maze. Yeah, it is. Here's the problem. I think... Wait, can I even make it? Yes, I could have. But it's going to make me not be able to jump back. No! Okay, you know what? I don't care. Unless that happens again where I need it, then... 
Am I am I stuck because of that one mistake? There we go. We did it. I feel like I can make this jump. It's not going to be an easy one, but I think I can do it. I've done this sort of like stuff before. Would the creator force us to do that? I don't know. Oh, let's do this. Oh, I don't have it favorited. Okay. No. Mm. Whatever, I can just do this. Another candy. Okay. So we got another candy. I just feel like at the end of each of those jumps is another candy. That's what I'm worried about. I genuinely feel like at the end of each of those places there's a candy that I'm just like missing. But we are gonna find out. Oh! There's just an easier way to go. Okay. There's just an easier way. I, I think I could have made that jump, but I don't think it was necessary. Okay. So I want to get this candy first here. Another candy. And then... That's some weird turtle maze. Ah, uh, okay. Let's go. Okay, let's go to the turtle maze now. Am I not turtly enough for the turtle club? It's a V. But... The number is... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 toitles. 13 toits. Torches, I'm not counting. And those are in a very familiar pattern, so I'll be able to just count that later. Oh! V... Yeah, equals five. Here's the thing, though. This ma maze is called Singala V. So it's the fifth version of the maze. That's the thing. So the V could mean that, but it could be mixed. Who knows? I'm not 100% sure. I can jump here, can't I? Okay, I don't think that was anything, but... I just noticed that I could. Oh, I can jump into the maze here? What? You could do that? Well, I guess you need the ladder first. I know there's other places we can jump. Okay, this is a dead end. That's fine. Uh, my eyebrow is like this naturally. Well, I guess a scar isn't that natural, but I guess. You're no longer a tiny gong. Yes, dances with pigs. You are a big gong. Finally all grown up. Yeah, I didn't need to do any of that stuff. I'm so extra for like caring. Okay, is there anything there? No, nothing. Okay. <gasps> there was a dig spot. There was a dig spot. Right there. Oh my goodness. There was... I don't think I can get there. I have to remember that there's a dig spot there. When I have the ladder. Break the rock and go up the stairs? 100%. What I like to do, and it might be very frustrating for you guys watching, is I like to complete everything before I move on. You know what I mean? Like, of course I saw that I had to break the rock and move on, but like... I felt like I needed to... Do something else first. Okay. There we go. What? There we go. Okay, another fossil. Whatever, that's fine. And let's go back this... There has to be a jump. Yep. Are we almost at the house? Well, we can't get there without a ladder. But where we are is near the next tool. 
Does this lead exactly? This does lead to the next tool. It does. It just, it has to, right? This just has to lead to it. Yes. Okay. There's another tool here. And it is a ladder. Woo. We just found the ladder. Oh my God. We just found the ladder. <laughs> oh God. That's so good. The last piece of the puzzle. That's it. We can go to the house now. I think we need to go up here soon. Um, I feel like we need to go in the house. I just feel like we have to do that. There's definitely something here. Like there's a hundred percent something here, but like, I don't care about that right now. Go back to the turtles for the dig spot. A hundred percent. Yes, true. So let's go back to there for the dig spot. The house is right here. Uh, let's go to the house while we're here. Like, we, we got it. Okay. The moment of truth. Okay. The moment of truth. This is the island crater and they give us a hint. January 1st, 1996. Well, those are numbers. Zero one. Zero one nine six. One one nine six. Oh, one one nine six. True. That could be one one nine six. So let's oh, let's see what we have here. One. One one nine six. Great. Can you move, bro? Okay. So this is where my hypothesis might be correct. I feel like there's going to be a row of items that show specific things in a certain order left to right. What is this? What? What is this? No! Wait, no. I feel like I'm being baited here. Remember that just because it looks empty doesn't mean it, it, oh, it is empty. Okay. But like sometimes there's something, there's sometimes items on that wall. Sometimes there's items on that wall that you don't see, right? So maybe it, things aren't always as, as they seem. <clears throat> It'll work one of these times, I promise. Okay, go to the basement. Sometimes things aren't always what they seem. Come on, I'm just trying to get a clip for the YouTube video, guys. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just trying to get a clip for the YouTube video. I'm just trying to, okay? Let's try it. Things aren't always what they seem. Were there multiple teacups? Anywhere? So there was one T, and T is a letter of the alphabet, and what number of the alphabet is it? I don't know. But later on, if that might be important, then we'll see. Two. Okay. Okay, there's two T's. Wait, I didn't check the wall on this one. I didn't check the wall. So let's go check the wall really quick. Things aren't always 
what they've seen. Oh, come on. One more room. There's one more room. Okay. T for tree. I think that's a bit of a stretch, but I think T is like a letter of the alphabet, which is also a stretch, but who knows? 2T equals 2D. Okay, Maddie, you're not helping. <laughs> Another T in the bottom corner. And... So it's top right, middle, bottom left. Not too much. All right, so there's three T's. L equal top R. Uh, M equal top middle. And R equal bottom L. Don't know what that really entails, but... So that's huge. It's definitely going to ask us to do something else kind of crazy, but... That's fine. Let's go dig up that turtle V. <laughs> Let's go dig up the turtle V. Wait, I can just climb down, can't I? So convenient. Wow. Okay, yeah, I actually had to stay back up. I don't want to go down. I want to... Alright, we just jump across here. And we go all the way. To the turtle V. Okay, I gotta favorite this really bad. All right, time to plant some bushes, to be honest. What's up, Sarah? How you doing? T is the 20th letter. Okay, time to plant a bunch of bushes, because this is annoying. Oh, wait, don't... Okay. It always says there's no space to plant, but I have room if I dig and then plant. So annoying. Okay. Stop. What's up, Gray? Ooh, let's go. Okay. Is there anything else on that side? No, okay. That's fine. It's fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh, do I have to? Okay. Cup. Coffee cup in the corner equals coffee corner. But there's also one in the middle. So is it like coffee middle? <laughs> oh. Wait. I feel like this is important though. Yes, this is what we do. We jump across and then we climb up. And then we find another place to climb up. And then we can transition somewhere. I think. No, I don't see anything. Wait, what? Wait. Why is this one in a weird position compared to the others? Oh no, they're not. They're not. What? That's so useless. Okay, there's nothing there. Hmm. Okay. Well. I think I can vault down here. What's up, Annika? All right, let's climb up here. I think there's a place I can climb up over here. Yeah, I th I mean, there's like a 50% chance I can. It's a 50% chance I can't, but. 
Alright, this is annoying. Nope, it's only a half one. Whatever. We can still do this. Yep, we can do this. Oh, yeah, perfect. Okay. Heck yeah. So that's a quicker way back. There's still another part of the maze over far on the right side with that heart kind of lake area. So we're going to definitely need to go back to that soon. Oh, wait, there was a there was something here, wasn't there? No, there's nothing on this part of the beach, but there might be stuff behind the houses, so we need to be careful. No, nothing? Okay. Okay, so now we can climb down here and get to this part of the maze. This is exhausting, I gotta say. I'm not even sure what part I need to get to. Oh, wait, is there something inside here? Oh, there's another coconut juice! There's another coconut drink. Nine. Okay, Kokomo. Chase, been watching your vids for years. Loving the face cam now. Also in Toronto. Hey, what's up? It snowed today. It's ridiculous. It snowed today in Toronto. Even for Toronto standards, that's kind of early. Oh, uh, okay. Have you played Stardew Valley? I have. It's a little stressful. So no, I, I'm not really that into it, but uh, it's pretty good. I think you would love it. Best wishes. Thank you. What's up? Always nice to see a fellow Torontonian. Snowed in Chicago too? It's crazy. I just don't want it to snow. It's not like it's that okay, to be fair, it's not like that crazy. It's like crazier things have happened, Chase, but like Oh, I can vault there and get past that um fence. There we go. We're finally out of there. Oh my gosh. We are progressing. Okay. The tent has to be this this tent right here has to be like the final straw. This has to be it. Let me check one more time just to make sure there's no items. Okay. 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 So we break this. How many more? Okay, we have two more candies. I really hope. Really hope that I don't run out. Okay. Let's go to these beds. It's a bed maze. That's fun. We're getting so close to the end. Okay, there's nothing there. Good. Too many candles. A lot of graves. Three graves? <gasps> Is it Morse code? And I don't have enough... Oh no, I don't have enough candy. I need to find one more candy. That's okay, but this is Morse code, a hundred percent. Uh, Morse code. All right, let me open this up on Firefox. Okay. Morse code. What? No. I don't want that. 
So what we got here is a dash, dash, no, dash, dash, da dash. Are these numbers? One, two, no, 22, one, two, three, four, 10, 22, no. That's the code! Wait, 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 no, wait. Look behind it, the blank spot's here. We don't need to break that last one. Look, look at this. This is, this is the final code. We need to count the number of shovels, something about a tent, red roses, and then another hint behind it, raw, like space rocks, Thing of art, turtles, sprocket, balloons, coffee, and coconuts. Oh my gosh. Okay. And there's lines underneath each of them. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to screenshot this really quick. Oops. I need to screenshot this. Okay. We got the capture taken and I'm also going to screenshot it for myself. Okay. I feel like we need to climb up there, though. That seems important. Oh, climb up and jump. You're right. I can just climb up and jump. Okay. So I can just climb up and jump, which is what I'm going to do. Climb down. Can I climb down? There's a candle there. But maybe this just helps me see. What's beside the roses though? So actually, I can't climb up and jump. What I have to do is break that rock and go all the way around. They really want me to do that, huh? But that's okay. We have the campsite, the number of shovels, but these are normal shovels. So I'm going to write this down just in a separate thing. So we got... There's two numbers. Long line, long line, two lines. Long line, long line, long line, long, long, long short because I think that's referring to the number of digits so one of them says happy birthday and it's the number of balloons and it shows two lines which means but January 1st 1996 could also be Wait, what happened on January 1st, 1996? Is there something special? Was there a special day? Jan 1st... It was just New Year's. The number one song in the UK was Earth Song by Michael Jackson. Nothing.
Is it just 96, the year they were born? But it's also January. It was January 1st, 1996. Not an eventful year. Not an eventful day. It's New Year's Day. But nothing here says New Year's. Okay. Next goal is try to make it all the way to the campsite villager. So we got a shovel. Shovel underscore. We got camp underscore. We got red roses dash dash. Space. Yeah, that's that that's a dream address, hundred percent. And then we got uh crater underscore uh art underscore toit. There's thirteen turtles. I'm so confused. Oh no, there's five. Okay, we're starting to figure this out. Woo! No, no, no. I, I can start filling in some of these. There's a few things I have to... I, I want to fill it out really quick. And then we can go further. So, toits underscore sprocket underscore. Then we got HBD under, uh, dash dash. Coffee dash coconut dash. Okay, so let me show you what I'm looking at. So this is what I'm looking at now. Let's quickly bring this down here. Um, that, that might help it be a bit more obvious for you guys. Okay. So the guaranteed thing that I do know is the uh, turtles was five. Happy birthday is two numbers. I think that's the total number of balloons, right? Oops, one, sec, one sec. So it could be the total number of balloons. So if we go up to the total balloons, number seven in pink balloons, but I think it's just totals. 17, 18 red, plus 14, 14, 14, 19, 16. So let's do calculator. Okay, let me quickly do this. We have 18. Oh, wait, but there's only three colors of the... If we look carefully, there's only three colors of the balloons, right? There's only three balloon colors. There's only yellow, red, and blue. Only yellow, red, and blue. So we're going to have to quickly uh, do this. So uh, 18 red plus 14 yellow. And then blue is 16. That's 48. That's possibly 48. 48. Cool. Okay, that's 48. Coconut juice, we had... How many coconut juice did we have? Um... Where does it say juice? Eight shrooms, seaweed, coconut drinks, nine. So that's nine. Green balloons, two? No, we have to remember, it doesn't show the color green. In the happy birthday sign, it doesn't show green at all. I don't know. We could count all of them, but I want to just, I, I think that's a hint. The devil's in the details. Coffee, I counted three. But there could be more. We have to go to Sprocket's thing. Art? I have no idea. I guess we have to count how many statues are somewhere around the island. Red roses? That's the interesting thing. It's two digits. And I counted the black roses in between, right? Remember I did that? So there's nine black flowers, flowers between the two red ones. But there's 57 before the first red flower and then 58 before the second one. That's not correct. Fifty-seven and then fifty-eight. Shovel three? No, that's incorrect. Uh, there's shovels placed carefully on the ground around the campsite, I believe, and around the map. So we'll see in a bit. Um, the roses. There was nine black flowers between each of them. Oh, you guys can't see that actually. 
There was nine black flowers between the two red ones. And there were 57 flowers before the first red flower. And then 58 before the second one. It can't be that many numbers. 31 rolls total on the flower beds. Um. Okay, one sec. Stop. Happy birthday could also be Jan. No, that doesn't make sense because the number would have to be so big. So the happy birthday could also be 96. Happy birthday, age 26. True. Okay, I feel like that's kind of all we have to go on right this second. I feel like there's not like too much more to go on. Check the passport. Oh my goodness, you're right. Can I? I can't. How do I check the passport here? can check mine no there is no passport hmm okay we're just gonna keep going because I, I want to prove that the shovel there are shovels placed I don't think it's just gold shovels because the shovel that they show there is not gold I just want to point out the shovel up there is not a golden shovel I think that's an important factor to be honest Are there two different dates on the Rex? Uh, the, oh, the service? No, there's only one date. Someone mentioned, mentioned to count the Capricorn tables because the season is Capricorn is Jen and I think that's a good hint. That's really good, but they were Cancer tables. The tables were Cancer ones. I haven't seen Capricorn tables. If you see them, let me know, please. But as far as I remember, those were Cancer tables. Those were Capricorn? No, it was it was Cancer. See, look at the number of shovels here. See what I mean? There's shovels here. These are the shovels. There's four shovels. So I'm going to open up and I'm going to put shovels as four. Four shovels. That's huge. And let's... Oh, I... Whatever. We're going to go inside. We'll see. Okay. Cancer is July, I know, but there's, okay, that's weird. Capricorn has a large statue thing? Okay, maybe somewhere. Hmm. There are no Capricorn tables, there's a statue. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Everyone kept said Capricorn's tables, I was confused. Fill in the blanks for the dream address. Helpful. But yeah, so there's four of those shovels. If we see any more of those shovels, let me know. This is a dead end anyway, though. Yeah, that's a dead end. Okay. What's next, chat? Something to do with art, which I have no idea. Um, Thirteen red roses. Two boxes in camp. Yeah, I can't do anything with the boxes. So, we need to go find Sprocket. There's also a crater. A crater! The crater's in the top right corner! I remember that. Amount of art displayed at the museum. That is such a good point. I could check out their museum. You can't check the mail. You can't check someone else's. And the other thing said camp. I know it says camp there, but I also want to point out there's a campsite. Oh, okay, look. Here. <clears throat> the campsite. We're at a tent. But that's not a camp, right? The campsite right here. And what was beside the campsite? Three leave piles of leaves. There were three piles of leaves. 
right beside the camp. Three piles of leaves. Three piles of leaves. Okay. That's huge. <clears throat> okay. Where was the Capricorn, um, s like, statue or whatever? Check out Sprocket's house. I'm going there right after I go to the museum and check the number of art that's displayed. Um, oh, I guess I just climb up. Check out Sprocket's house. I think it's just up north of me here. Or maybe it's below? I forget. Okay, so... <clears throat> so we need to go to the art in the back, right? Yes. One. Two. Three. Maybe there's like dates on this. September 5th. Oh, never mind. Doesn't make sense. So that's three. I saw the statue earlier, but I'm still going to count three. Four. Five. Six. All right. One last roundabout to check. One. Two. Three. Four, five, six. Six for the art. That is a six. We're getting close. Because it showed statues and everything. Okay. There's a candy near the campsite. There was a candy near this campsite? Where? Wait, there was a candy near the campsite? Can't. Oh, dig spot. It's a dig spot. Totally. Okay, cool. Um, well, I'll go back there when I can. As for now, I want to go to Sprocket's house. So next up, we are going to go to Sprocket's house and figure it out. There's also a bunch of dig spots, uh, which could. Oh, there's a dig spot right there. There's a dig spot right there. Okay, let's go to that dig spot. Oh, if this is a candy, that'll be awesome. Nope, it's a fossil. Okay. Okay, that's fine. Let's just drop that while I can. Alright, Sprocket's house. It's probably the ugliest house here. I'm not gonna lie. Probably the ugliest one. Probably this one. Or the one behind it, I don't know. Big top? No. Okay. Sprocket's house? Alright. And... It's probably his, his, uh, saying. Is there a saying? He says Zort. Zort? It showed Sprocket. It was just a picture of Sprocket, was it not? There's just one sprocket on the island, true. Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay, one sec. Is this house default? This is, is this his default house? I think so. Yeah, that's exactly what his house normally looks like. Okay, never mind. I was going to say if there was like an extra item in here. Okay, sprocket. Oh, four! Zero four at the back of his head! There's a four at the back of his head! <gasps> that's so smart! What? So that means sprocket is four. <sighs> that's so smart! Oh my god! Oh man! What? is going on that's insane okay um okay for the number of roses that would it has two numbers which is why I'm confused so okay so sprocket is number four we need to go to the crater camp and the red roses and then we're pretty much done I think that's all we need so let's open this up so it's it says right down here uh can you see yeah so it's so far we have four blank. It's I'm guessing it's three, but it might not be. Four blank 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 six five four four eight three nine. Okay. Um. Apparently there was a candy or like a dig spot near the campsite. Uh, I think. Play is. To stay up here and I want to go towards the crater. I think that's the play. Wait, why am I doing this? I can just do this. <laughs> I can just climb down. I don't have to follow the rules. I don't have to follow the maze. I do whatever I want. Look at this. Oh no. Chase, you're cheating. No, I'm not. I'm not doing anything wrong. Okay. So. I want to go to the other side of the island here. I want to possibly solve the mystery of that crater. The little heart crater. Because it did say crater. And I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what that's supposed to do or mean or anything, but... Mm. Can I even get up there? I don't think so. No, I can't. I forgot that... Oh wait, no, wait. I'm not completely hopeless. I can do this. Yup. That's right. Ah, that just happened. I did it. Okay. Can I jump on here? Nope. There's a dig spot right there on the crater. Yeah, but there's there's no real easy way to get up from here. Yes, there is. I've been covering the screen this whole time. I was covering... Okay, one sec. One sec. I'm going to rewind for the YouTube video. <clears throat> no, don't worry, none of this happened. Nothing happened here. Nothing happened. <clears throat> okay, so I just came over to this side here. I don't think I can get over this part. Don't worry, chat, I didn't mess up. What, what are you saying? I didn't... Nothing happened. Um, we can climb up somewhere along here. Let's try it. No, that's not working. Okay. There's a lot of Capri Sun tables. Um, no, those are cancer tables. There's the moon in here. What I do want to do is get to the end. Can I climb up? Come on, let me climb up. There we go. I guess I'll just climb down here. 
Can I not? Okay, I think I just need the vaulting pole or something. The vault in our stars. Okay, let's go back down here. Yeah, I think I can just vault around the bottom here. I can just do this. I don't know why I made it so complicated. And then I can, uh, oh, one more, this one. Then I can climb up here. And then I can dig that. Please be a candy. Please be a candy. If it's a candy, we're like done. No, we're not. That's that's a lie. That's a complete lie. It's a fossil. It's a fossil. Let's drop that. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's check if there's anything behind here. Maybe there's not, but... Alright, there has to be some obvious something here. Um, I want to pull up the picture really quick for myself. The art. Happy birthday coffee. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. We have the giant crater, which looks like a moon. Roses and the campsite. Yeah, it's the campsite. So we're gonna go back to the campsite and the roses are the only issue I have in the crater. The crater is something I can't figure out. Because I personally maybe it's like the moon. Maybe that was the moon. I feel like that's just the moon. And not anything like else. Another candy. Okay. So we had that. And so that's the last candy we need. Luckily. And I feel like... I just don't know what I want to... Is it like how many moons are here? Alright, let me look at the picture a little bit better. doesn't look like a moon it looks like a crater it looks like a crater on the moon which means I can count the moons on the island that doesn't that isn't what it looks like so like a number here anything obvious okay I'm gonna be right back guys I have to go uh, pee I'll be literally 10 seconds well, okay not 10 but you know what I mean like one minute Chair crossing content, okay? He's gonna do some tricks for you. All right, I'm back. One sec, my hands are still still wet. Okay. The moon. Forgot the timer. Whatever, it's fine. It wasn't that long. What is this? It's a crater. A bunch of moons and it is at night. Oh my goodness. So I want to like pull up and I'll put it on stream so that you guys can see it a bit better. Let me just uh, get it ready. I want you guys to see the image a bit better. 
so it's just a little bit easier for you guys to like process and remember so image all right so this is the image right here and i want you guys to pay attention carefully this is the moon so that's what it shows like so these are actually just the three that we need we need the uh we need this campsite in the left we need the roses and then we need that looks like a moon right that's all i saw let's go to the campsite clear our mind a little bit maybe the cancer tables there's so many cancer tables I think it's just the number of moons. I think so too. Yeah, do you think so? Is that what it would be? Okay. So I'm going to count the number of moons here, okay? But I think there's more on the map elsewhere. Right? So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, six wait, wait, sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and that would be eight. Maybe. I don't know. That's eight moons. That's what I think the crater is. I can't count the craters of the moons. There's six moon chairs, one big moon and one actual moon in the sky. It's the moon shaped island in the middle of the crater. Yeah, I just, I just don't even know anymore. Whatever. Okay, we're going to go to the campsite now. Uh, if I can get there. Oops, let's climb down. The powder on the table looks like uh, 69. That's just what it looks like. Don't, don't need to elaborate. That's just exactly what it looks like, and I'm not making that up. That's what it looks like. I'm not being immature. Okay. Are there any other craters on the map? No. There aren't, but we're going to go to the campsite. I mean, I could just run across the beach. It's quicker. Because this is the difficult part. The shovel could be there were just those four shovels that we found, like that were on the ground, or they could be the three golden shovels, which I doubt. But it could also simply just be all of the shovels, like three that I found plus four on the ground. Okay. This has to be something. Please. This can't be a fossil. It's another candy. So,
Well, I guess there's going to be one more rock that we have to break. Right. We need, we have two candies though. I only saw one rock I had to break, but maybe there's two. There's probably another one somewhere else. That's good. At the campsite, there are three piles of leaves. Three. So I'm going to guess that there are, it, the camp is three. So, and then the, the, the roses are a difficult one. Okay. Can I just vault to this? Like, that would save me so much time. No, because that would be too easy. Why would they why would they let me do that? That would be crazy. Roses, I think it's the number of red roses, including the red rose beds above it. Yep. That's what I'm thinking. Alright, I should be able to get back into the maze from here. That's my bet. Can I do that? No? Oh, come on. I really thought the game really had me thinking that I could. Anyway, while I'm here on the beach, I may as well uh, enjoy it. Check out everything that I can. See if there's an easier way back into the map from here. No, there isn't. Uh, but anyway, yeah, we need to go to the secret beach anyway, so that's fine. Oh, I need to put this away. What's up, lemon grass? Count the roses, then guess the last number for the moon. Here's a problem. Like, if I do the roses and then it's wrong, was the roses wrong? Oh, wait, but what about the turtles? Was that wrong? Oh, wait, what was... Could the camp be wrong? Is the shovel wrong? Maybe the positioning of the red roses among the black ones. That's what I thought too. Right. So I did actually write that down initially. So I wrote down that the... Oh, I actually ended up deleting it. But I was counting how many roses were before the red ones. But it didn't make sense. So. Didn't quite make sense. Go break this rock Oop, to progress a little bit further. What's a crater? I don't think that's correct. Like, why didn't they just draw a crescent moon? Like, literally, why didn't they just draw a crescent moon? And what was up with the date? Like, why did the date say January 1st, 1996? What's up, just normal? We are solving probably one of the hardest mazes I've ever done. This is something else. I can't check the passport, not in the dream, unfortunately.
This is really something else. Okay. Let's go back and uh, break the last rock. Maybe there's two rocks. I don't know. Maybe there was an extra candy just in case. this candy. I don't know why I said it so aggressively. Eat this. Break this. Keep moving. There's probably one more rock behind here. So one says roses, camp. Now we can see them properly. That's so weird. The crater. Yeah, that has to be the moons, I guess, in the crater. What's that last candy for, though? Like, who cares that I got up here? Okay, that circle has to be the crater. Hmm. And no, it is not the creator. Uh, and it's not a double digit number. It's single digit. So these lines on the ground represent the numbers. So one number, one number, one single, single, double digit, single, single. So this is what we have so far. So we have four, three, blank, blank. No, I'll do underscore and score. Four, three, blank, blank. Uh, we have eight, six, five, four, four, eight, three, nine. This is what we kind of have so far. But the red roses is simple enough, I think. So the happy birthday is 96. That's what I thought, but it's showing balloons. So it could be 96, or 48, or a higher number. Or 1-1. One, one. Well, I mean, it could be 96, it could be 1-1, one, one. it could be... It could be 96, it could be 1-1. One, one. Uh... Could be about five different things at this point, yeah. Could the roses be as simple as O2? Yeah, the roses could be O2. We got January 1st, 1996 from the creator when we talked to them outside their house. What about all the digits and the date added together? 98. See, at this point, it's getting too complicated.
Are the roses just zero two? Does anybody want to try this dream address code? I don't want to uh, wake up. You have to count the Capricorn thing. Where is the Capricorn thing? Uh, 96 birthday, 69 cancer. Oh! That's interesting. 19, January 1st, 1996 versus the can the table saying 69. So that's not correct, is it? Oh man. I think the happy birthday means the age it would be the date of birth. There was a giant area with like a hundred balloons in it. And the happy birthday thing shows three balloons. Yellow, red, and blue. If I add those three numbers up, it gives me 48. All of the red balloons plus all of the yellow balloons plus all of the blue balloons. At no point did it say that his birthday was January 1st, 1996. At zero point. Did that ever get mentioned? So that is completely just us guessing. It also says a present. You're right. I have... Is there any Capricorn anything in this island? I don't think so. There was no... Yeah, there, there's none. There was zero Capricorn tables. Alicia is our newest Buchu Bay. Hey, Tiny Gong. That's okay. Welcome to the family. It's, look, it's not about the size of your gong. It's about how you use it. Okay? And please use it for good. Don't use it for evil. Okay? Don't do that. We don't like that. Those are cancer tables. Yeah, the the six nine like the yin yang thing is cancer in the crap. I'm a cancer, so I know that. Da doesn't exist. Okay. Oh yeah, welcome back, Alicia. Sorry, I'm thinking about other stuff. Welcome back. Three months. Three months you're back for. Okay, so something's wrong here. Okay. Like, what's wrong at this point? I actually messaged the island creator. They they never replied. I messaged them like two weeks ago. Hoping, hopefully I could, would get a reply, but didn't happen. It could be the beds too. Okay, what else? There, what ones are we completely sure about? Okay. The ones that I am 200% sure of. There's a couple numbers that I'm completely sure of, okay? Let me see, code. So. Yes. And then... 100%. Okay, so for the 100% guaranteed, I, I there's no way I'm wrong about this, is the art being 6. So I'm going to do blank, blank. Um, blank, blank. Great. First one we're not even sure about. We're going to do blank. I'm guaranteed that's correct. Uh, guaranteed that's correct. And guaranteed that's correct. Then, happy birthday, don't know. Coffee is definitely three and coconut is definitely nine. Oh, that's, I wrote four. Three. So that's what I'm 100% sure of, right beside what I'm not sure of. It's eight rose beds, which would take us to double digits for 10 total. 
that's Olivia that's not correct because oh that would bring us up to 10 okay so then no that's, that's correct okay so with the roses being these ones where I have zero two if I delete the zero two and do one zero can somebody try that one da four three one zero and then try that code I'm gonna be right back I need more water I'm completely out be right back Okay, that's not correct. Okay, so that's incorrect. Okay, so the roses could be 10. So the roses could be 10, 0, 2. But the roses, another thing with the roses that I did notice is with the roses, I counted the number of black flowers in between them. So before the first red flower, there was 57. And then between the other two, there was 58. So between the first and the second red flower, there was 58. There were 58 ones before there. So. Could be 58. So if we change one zero to five eight, what happens? Happy birthday could also be twenty five, twenty seven, or ninety six. Oh my goodness, there's so many options. I feel like the the roses is either 10 or 2, but I just want to have another one. I don't know. It takes you guys like a second to test. I really wish I could test. No DA available. So 58 could be wrong. Okay. So I'm going to go back to the, the flowers that I think is the most correct. And I'm going to do 0, 2. And then 4, 3 I think is correct as well. 4 shovels. Crater is the 8 moons. It doesn't even make sense. Happy birthday doesn't make sense either. Coffee and coconut, I believe I'm correct. Did anybody else also do it and count the coconuts? I don't think the roses is 0 2 since Sprocket had 0 4 in his head. No, because look, the roses is double digits. So these lines on the ground represent uh, the number of digits it takes up. So. It definitely is double digits no matter what. So it could be one zero. It could be zero two. Wouldn't zero four be a double digit? No, because there's no double digit written here on the ground. Yeah, it could be. I mean, I think it's 50-50 whether it is. Because, look, they're specifically showing the picture of a rose. There's, It's very specific. A picture of a rose. Not just, like, the rose with the stem. Not just a rose. If it was just the rose petal, then I would say the beds. That's why I'm not believing Because there were eight moons and the moon has eight phases. Wait, what phase is the moon right now? Wait, what phase is the moon right now? In the sky? It's being covered. Of course it is. 
What phase is this moon? Total number of roses was way more than 100, so it doesn't count. What number would it be? Rose is either two. You can make the rose be one, one. I think it's two. Zero, two or something else. The moon. Hmm. the moon is in the first quarter is that a one? Oh, this is so too difficult i think guys here's the thing i need to go to the second island i can't cheat on this because i can't just say hey we finished it we didn't finish it because i need to know the dream address to the next island the moon could just be one the crater could be eight or a one. The camp, I believe, is just three piles of leaves. Red roses could be a 10, a two, or 58, but I think 58 is a stretch. So I'm gonna delete 58. Happy birthday could be a 25, it could be 27, it could be 96, or 48. I do believe the crater is eight. That's the guess we're gonna do. So Steffi said, you said, someone try this dream address. Okay. Somebody please try that. Yeah. There's only one campsite. The reason is, is because it very specifically shows this. See that campsite? That is specifically this sign outside of the villager campsite. That's why. I think the balloons is 27 or 72 since the balloons were laid out as two, 7 and 2. Ooh. But Kate, where was the 2? I didn't see the 2 in the balloons. I did see a seven in front of happy birthday. Wait. It could be 27. Happy birthday might be 27. Two is a yellow that we're calling. Oh, then that doesn't make sense. Hmm. I have pretty much everything written down. So if you guys have questions about numbers of stuff, I do have it. Um, the number seven in pink balloons was 100%. But happy birthday specifically shows only three colors of balloons. Balloons in total. How many balloons were in total? Wait, how many balloons were actually in total? So the it's 18 red plus 14 yellow plus 14 green plus 19 pink plus 16 blue. 81. Ugh, that's too many numbers for happy birthday. <sighs> there was no gift that I could find. Unfortunately, there was a ton of watering cans. <sighs> 
One present, three balloons. Could it be that simple? Why is happy birthday have five options? So happy birthday can be 48, 25, 27, 96, 81, or 13. However, we'll never be able to guess that because we don't know if the other ones are wrong, like the red roses or the crater. Although I do believe the crater is eight. So I'm going to do my best guess right here. So the best guess that I can do right now is four, three, one, zero. Eight, six, five, four. And then we have blank, blank, three, nine. So what we can do in the blank is these numbers. 48. We do 48, 25, 27, 96, 81, 13. Try those. So. So we can put in the blank 48, 25, 27, 96, 81. <laughs> Remember, this island does have decoration, so. You tried 48 and 96 already? Okay. We're almost at the three hour mark and I'm slouching so hard in my chair right now. So hard. This is taking so much out of me. Okay. We're really close. Romar, uh, I want to point out one last time. Uh, the lines at the bottom here represent how many digits it could be. So he's right. It said it could be two rose plants or eight rose beds. That's a huge option. So it could be two rose plants and eight rose beds or the other way around. It could be 28 or 82. Wait, Olivia, what are you trying? On the, in the last digit, you want to try only the numbers that I wrote down to the right. You don't want to try anything else. The reason is because... Ooh, what did I just do there? Because if you start trying other... We start out trying other things. 10 for roses well we can't say it's not 10 for roses because again it doesn't even if we get the right number for roses if we have the number for happy birthday wrong then we miss out Why do people keep saying the number 13? What do you mean 13? Who's talking about 13? What's 13? I haven't read. Oh, the happy birthday one, not 13? Yeah. Why did I write down 13 for happy birthday? Oh, 1 3. I see. It was the last one. See ya, Kokomo. Might be 896 or 81. Man. So here's the thing, um, the island was posted, uh, if we rewind the stream right to like the beginning. Then you can see the, on the bulletin board, 
It's like the 13th of last year, 2021. So, they would be 25. Would they not be? Yeah. Last year, you'd be 25. So, I don't think it's 27. So, we can get rid of that number. So, code. So, we can get rid of 27. So, now it's 96, 81, 13. So, I think... I think 25. They'd be 25 on their birthday. It'd be 25. 96, I feel like is wrong. 48 is the number of balloons. 81, the total balloons. I think that's wrong. 13 is wrong. I think it's 48 or 25. It's none of that. Then try this. Four three zero two. Hmm. Crying as I type right now. It's neither of those. It's not 25, 39, or 48, 20, that blah blah. Oops. Okay. So again, what are the ones that I think I'm wrong on? So I do know one thing the coconut juice is correct. Because. It only requires a single digit, and we have nine. So if there was one extra that we missed, then it would be ten. It would be double digits, so it doesn't count. Coffee could be wrong, to be fair. Happy birthday is definitely something wrong. Art is correct. Crater is correct. Camp, three piles there. It has to be correct. Could be four because of the letters in camp, but that's wrong. Yellow tent is empty. It's just the default one, not even unpacked. Um. If I count the cans in the balloon section. What do you mean the cans? Okay, one sec. Let me just quickly, uh. Let me delete that. Uh, I want to see moon phase one. Red roses, blah, 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 camp. I'm going to go to... Here's the problem. Even the first one, shovel, could be wrong. But again, it's not showing a golden shovel. It's just showing a regular shovel. And there's only four. Um, hmm. Oh, is it going in and out? Uh, chest one, two. Oh, well, that's weird. Weird. Okay, one second. Let me listen to my stream. Okay, one second. Let me listen to my stream. So again, what are the ones that I... So here's the thing. Uh, juice is... Weird. Everything's fine on my so end. So here's the thing. Uh, juice is... Yeah, it's fine. What? Why isn't Happy Birthday 26? Because this island was posted uh, in 2021. Okay. Okay, we're going to go quickly back to the start. Yeah, 
let's go back to the start. How many turtles were there? There was 13 turtles. However, they were in the shape of a V, which means five. <laughs> read the bulletin board. Yeah, I'll read it one more time just so you know, but it's 2021. The date on the bulletin board is 2021. I don't know. It just, I, it could be it. Like, I don't know. All right, we're here. So we're going to go back here and bam. September 13th, 2021. For clues, seek Tagasundo and... It just confirmed that Quickie confirmed. It was just confirmed. I guys, I want to point this out. It's huge. It just confirmed that the only person that gives you a hint is Tagasundo. Quickie does not give a hint. I want to repeat. Quickie does not give a hint. No hint. Yeah. So the only hint is from the person at the tent. So January 1st, 1996 is a red herring. It's only to do with the number of balloons, which means it's 48. It's 48. Not 96. No, it shouldn't be. So this is the best guess. It's still wrong, but that means that at least it means there's something else wrong. Okay. The total number of balloons. What was that? 81? So it could be, uh, four, eight, eight, four, wait, four, 48, eight, one, 39. It could also be that. Take us on dose at January 1st, 1996, 81. So that's the total of balloons. We're going to go back down to the balloon area. Okay. Oh, it's been a while since, since I've been here. Alright. We did very clearly see... RGB. RGB is the... Color of stuff. That means it's pink is irrelevant. These are pointless. We had candy, which was the happy birthday. We had a bunch of watering cans, which aren't important because it didn't reference them at all. No, it's not RGB. It's R Y B. That's the most clear seven I've ever seen in my life. That pink one, right? That's a seven. That's not a four. Do I see another number? No, no number there. The blue also doesn't have a number. Pink doesn't have a number. Yellow say two? People say that, but like, let me go ch look at the them. Because if it does look like an obvious two, then it is a two. Oh, that kind of looks like a two, but it, it would be more obvious. Wouldn't they make it a more obvious two? All right, so the happy birthday could be 81, but it could also be 72. All right, so try this one. Seventy-two doesn't work anyway. Hmm. The dinos, no. I'm stumped. Because we could be wrong at like any point. 
and the crater is ignoring me. Which is kind of tilting, to be honest. Hmm. See if I can DM them or something. Wait, what was their Twitter? Do 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 do. Hmm. The total from the three colors is eighty-one. Last I counted. I'm gonna count one more time. Oh wait, total from the three colors. You're right. Uh, the three colors is a different one. It's 50, 48. 48. You already tried that. It's It would be 40. It would be this code if it was um, the, the colors that I counted before. Let me count it again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 12. Was it that correct? Let me check one more time. I said 11 red, yellow is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 yellow, yep. Green shouldn't matter, but still, I counted 10 before. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, yep. Pink is, I double counted these anyway when I was first here, but whatever. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, pink. Oh wait, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, yeah, it's 10. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Blues. Yeah, I think I'm correct on this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Red. One, two, three, four, five. That green is four. Four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Pink. And. Six blue. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, my numbers were correct. The number of dinosaurs for the crater. I totally get what you mean, to be honest. Are the dinosaurs the present? Are the dinosaurs the present? So any way we could find out their birthday through this? Camp says three because there was three piles of leaves beside it. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Maybe 11, 9, 10, 10, 10, no. 14 dinos tried that as well. Here's the thing is like trying the 14 dinos is dif difficult. Does the color of the dino matter? I don't think the dinos matter at all. I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. I don't think they matter at all. And I think we're overthinking that much. To show you guys the map and I'm gonna share it actually I'm gonna put it on the screen the 
This is the map. So. You can see what they call everything. Sina Sinagtala. What does that mean? By the way, what is Sin... It means starlight. And that crater is called Star Crater. It's the number of stars. But there's there's not a there's not a picture of stars. Like that's too much. And it's only single digit and there's too many stars. What's up, Amara? It's not the stars. There's more than nine. There's more. It says bed of roses. Okay, so I've been so sure this whole time. It's 4302. Let's do 10 again. Can we try this? Maybe not 48, maybe like others. The moons could be wrong too. I don't know. They're not actually, they don't actually link their, uh, oh, there we go. Let me, let me find them. Sina, Sinag, Tala Island. No, they don't have a Twitter. That's a shame. I already DM'd them though. Wait, what? There's a picture here of somebody finishing the island. But look at the crater. Look around it. They have the, the fragments there. They have the fragments there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. But that's twelve, so that's still too many. Because that was only supposed to be one number. Oh, that doesn't matter. Hey, Eddie. I don't know. The algorithm hates me right now. That's okay. Don't say we have to count each fragment. We don't. We definitely don't. There's no way. One sec, I'm gonna watch the trailer and see if there's anything here. It's two minutes long. I can't watch this. Okay. What if your dream is just a dream? Can I watch this? Wait, can I just open this up on Firefox? Can I watch these without having an account? No, don't do that. Okay. All right. I want to watch this. Of course you want me to sign an Instagram so you can sell my data. How about no? How about you just let me use it? God, please stop. That is so frustrating that I can't show you guys because I, I don't know my password. I'm not going to lie. Whatever. I'm just going to keep watching it. You guys can go find it. Middle click. What? It works. Oh. Okay, then it does work. Why did they uh do that? So stupid. Okay. Thank you. 
All right, let's do this. So it shows us going through here. Is this music copyright free? I don't know. I'm going to keep it muted until then. Shows us running up here. Okay, well, that's just wrong because the last one. Okay, hi. So we are correct. Art is zero six. Crater is zero. Oh, that might be just a different different one. Okay, hike. That is a good option. Okay, so that's wrong. That's obviously wrong. So what I want to point out is that some of those numbers are correct. So let's take what they guarantee, because I, I just know the last one is wrong. It's not, that's, uh, let me quickly paste it. So it shows up, you wrote that. Well, it can't be 9-3, it has to be 3-9, guaranteed. No way. And then how is the crater zero? Is the crater just a zero, great zero? No, it's showing the one moon in the middle. This is what they're saying right now. David! I know you can figure this out. Use that shirt, King Brain. <laughs> romantic cat face. I'm romantic not short. Cat face. Willy Bonka is a maze solution supreme being. Thank we you. We believe in you, romantic cat face. All trolling aside, best of luck figuring this out. Thank you so much, David. Oh my goodness. That one's the correct one. So what we what was okay? So the bulletin board. Okay, unfortunately, yeah, that's the one I have on screen. Okay, so the thing is, number one, the crater hole being zero makes no zero. I guess it makes no sense. I guess it's because it's ground zero. That's kind of eh, whatever. Number two. The, um, happy birthday being the date when he clearly said, like, like they said not to talk to the person that gave the date. So we were right about it being 25. All right. So this is what we have so far. Okay. We have four shovels, three piles of leaves at the campsite. The red roses, there is two red roses, but if you count the beds, it's actually 10. So right now we have four, three, one, zero. Let me just quickly, uh, let me re-record this for reference. Okay. Okay. Delete it. Okay. So now this is what we have. Okay. We have four because there was four shovels at the campsite. There were three piles of leaves at the other campsite, like the actual campsite where people are visiting. Okay, I'm gonna have to repeat that again because I that's stupid. So right now we got number four for the number of shovels near the tent, which is not the campsite. Actually at the campsite down on the beach, we found three piles of leaves. That was where we got three. The red roses, there was 10 in total if you count the beds because it specifically says on the map flower beds. The crater is zero for some reason, I guess because it's ground zero, or because it's the shape of the moon. Zero. Then we have the art. There were six pieces of art between the statues and the art pieces on the wall. There were turtles where there were 13. However, they were in the sh shape of a V, and V is five in Roman numerals. Sprocket, zero four on the back of his head. That was a genius one. The birthday one is very clever. It's a January 1st, 1996, when we talked to the villager. And then when we go to the bulletin board, we check. It was posted in 2021. It said, happy birthday. 
and two digits, which means they were turning 25. So therefore we have 25 there. On top of that, we inside the house, we found three cups of coffee. I think they were tea, but they're coffee. <laughs> and there were nine coconuts on the island, giving us the dream address 43100654253939, leading us to the next island. Whew. The moon is shaped like a zero. It's a zero. I think it's a really s silly one. I felt like the moon phase should have been the moons. It was weird. But like, whatever. It is what it is. <clears throat> Whoa! So... Once I type in this code, we will lock in our time, if it's correct. Okay. I want to dream. Okay. Come on, let's connect to the internet. Let's go. Please, let's do it before three hours and 30 minutes. Please. Oh my gosh. Search by dream address. Whew. You guys ready? <laughs> oh my god. Ah. Uh. It's like I was I want to make the next stream really quickly. Stream doesn't end until we finish this maze. Perfect. Give me one sec, guys. I actually have to just set up for the next one before I forget and then make a huge silly mistake. Okay. I know the timer. I don't really mind the timer. What's up, Cindy? Okay. Okay. Now, here it goes. So, we guessed four shovels, three at the campsite, the red roses, there were ten in total. The crater, or the moon, or whatever, Ground zero is zero. Six pieces of art. Turtles making the number five. Sprockets number four. For the birthday, they were turning 25. Three cups of coffee. Nine coconuts. Confirm. Let's... Go! Oh my god. Control. And we want to pause. Three hours and 32 minutes. With some breaks, with some breaks, but that's okay. I forgot to pause sometimes. Let's go. I want to see what the map looks like. Oh my god. <sighs> this is ridiculous and this is bright oh my goodness that's bright that's a little bit bright i don't like it oh this is insane yeah and we wake up on island number two wait why does it look the same what? 
It's the same. What? The map is the same? Okay, guys. Well, we're going to solve this maze. You know what we're going to do? We're going to be doing it on Thursday at 4 p.m. EST, guys. We're going to be continuing this challenge Thursday, 4 p.m. EST. You better be here to help us finish this maze. Uh, repeat, the stream will not end until we finish it, okay? We are going to go there right now. I can't do any more today. But to, on Thursday, in two days, 4 p.m. EST, we are going to be doing this. Oh my god, that was fun, guys. Thank you so much for coming. And who's in the chat? Who are we going to be talking to? All right. Uh, nope, we're not doing anything until tomorrow. Oh, not tomorrow. Thursday stream. All right, guys. Who's in chat? We got Olivia, Kate, Michelle, Sam, Marissa, Jenny, Caramel, Dance with the Pigs, Mel, Megan, Hiki, Hiki, I forget how to say it. We got Cindy, Eileen, Glorymar, Cassie, Eunice, uh, Donnie, Ariel, Amara, Jilly, A, Archetype, Alicia, Megumi, Utah, something like that, uh, Kokomo, Eddie, Steffi, Donnie, Airbender, Pixie, I've said those names multiple times, Christina, uh, Jariah, Cassie, guys, this was a crazy fun stream. Uh, let's go finish it tomorrow, okay? I'm gonna raid the next video right there. Um, also, guys, go check out my most latest video I just posted. It's really good. Uh, follow me on Instagram if you want to see pictures of me and video of me. You want to see me. You want to see more of me. Uh, follow me on Twitter if you care about memes or something. And uh, yeah, <laughs> uh, make sure to like the stream if you had a fun time. We are gonna go. Bye, guys. Big heart. Let's go.